Turns out I'm really bad at being a good baby. Or I'm really good at being a bad baby. I'm Kylie Keehan, and let me tell you something. Being a baby left alone at home is a dangerous thing. Why? It's not dangerous for the baby. It's dangerous for everybody else around the baby, the house, the neighborhood, possibly the entire planet. Why, you ask? Well, you're about to find out. This game is called Baby Hands, and yes, you can see my little baby hands. Today, we're basically playing around as a baby in in a playground, um, which is our house, I guess. We can get into all kinds of shenanigans as a baby here. You can kind of see the controls. I, I think that I figured them out. The movement is very, very unique. Now, as you can see, we are very low to the ground. That's because we're a baby and we're basically on our belly like we're crawling. So in order to move, you have to actually crawl. Look at that. <laughs> it's so crazy. So you could just kind of move around like that. It's fun. It's fun. Look, we're doing baby stuff. Look, we can, we can, here, look, we're a smart baby. So we're going to play with our donuts here. Look at that. And then this one, like that. And then this one goes like that. And then, oh, wait. Oh, this one actually looks like a real donut. Can I, can baby eat? Baby, baby doesn't have teeth yet. That's fine. Uh, th this one. Right? And then, th nope, nope, this one. Ah, look at how smart I am. I'm the world's smartest baby. Boom. Look at me now, mama. Look at me now. Yeah, that's right. Where are you? Uh, parents, hello. Hello, baby did something very impressive. Where are you guys? You need to see this. It's the most amazing thing you'll ever see a baby do. I promise. I prom, okay, okay. All right, enough of that. Jack in the box. Hello. Uh, what are you gonna do? You're gonna, you're gonna, I know what you're gonna do. I know what Jack in the boxes do. I know what's gonna happen. I don't, hey, oh, it's like, it looks just like the Jack in the box from the Jack in the box fast food franchise. If you guys are familiar, what are we gonna get there? Uh, what is what is famous Jack? Is that something that, that they make at Jack in the Box? I don't know. What, little octopus, little squeaky octopus. Oh, oh, he's so squeaky. Get out of here. Nobody likes you. Uh, I'm I'm sorry. Come back. Come back. You see that chicken over there? There's a chicken over there. Okay. We should. Oh, there's also a kitty. Oh, kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here, have an owl. No, didn't get you. Hmm, I'll just put that in my mouth there. Yeah, yep, yep, got it. Okay, oh, more squeakies. Here, cat. Uh. Oh, I hit him. I'm sorry, kitty. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Can we still be friends? I don't know. I don't like the binky. Get out of here. It's gross. All right, let's, how do we get out of our cage? I think, actually, we grab the screwdriver, and then can we, oh, look at that. Baby's gotta get in some trouble. Oh, but first, we must, we must unlock this. Holy cow, we must unlock the treasure. Wh where's the triangle? I need a triangle. There's a triangle block somewhere around here. Okay, we got, we got the square block. So square block goes right there. But we've got a lot more shapes to find. We gotta, wait, let's see, we gotta, oh, I can stand up. That's right. Okay, so I can't move when I'm standing up, but I can stand up. So we got a triangle, a moon, a circle, and a, and a tri- Did I say triangle? I said a st My shapes! I'm sorry, I'm a baby. I'm still learning shapes, okay? You gotta bear with me here. Circle, moon, star, triangle. That's what we have to find. So maybe, maybe we'll find them. What, what? We gotta, can we? Oh, what? Oh, that is so cool. Can I, can I shoot the, oh, I'm taking down the castle. You're gonna get destroyed, castle. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. This is so cool. Look at the little punchy guy. I like the punchy guy. What? What is this thing? Can I? Oh! Spin! Spin for me top! Okay, go over there. Oh, wait. There's a, there's a... Oh, look at this. We got another block. We need to take it back. We need to take it back to our treasure chest. I really want to see what's inside the treasure chest. Please. Where's... Where's the... 
I, I gotta back up. I don't, I don't remember how to back up. How do I back up? Tell me how to back up, game. There's a way. This way. There we go. Okay. I needed it. I was right up in the chest. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. So what, what do we got left? A moon, a star, and a triangle. Moon, star, triangle. We can do that. We can definitely do that. Can I punch this guy? Hey, you want to pick a fight with a baby? No, let's do this. What? What? You got nothing. You got nothing. Look at this baby skills. I'm the next Rocky. I'm the next Rocky. You, you watch your back. You watch your back, man. I'm going places. All right. Where, where should we go now? There's so much to explore. Oh, there's gloves. Can I put on? Can I put on the gloves? I can totally put the gloves on. Oh, this is so cute. I'm adorable. Look at me putting on my own gloves. Mom's gonna love it. There's a xylophone over there. Let's go to the xylophone. I don't need these stinking gloves anymore. Let's play some jams. I know. I know. I'm the best. I know. So musically inclined. The next Rocky. Oh, look at that. That's so good. Oh, that's beautiful music. Beautiful music. Play the piano. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Both instruments at the same time. You like that, Mom? Mom? Look at me. Look at me. The next Mozart over here, right? Okay, get out of here. This is ridiculous. My gosh, is this my actual room? <laughs> it's so magical. This can't be my room. I don't think this is my room. I think this might be a, a sibling's room. This might be my older brother's room. This looks like the room of a slightly older child. I don't know what to do with some of these toys. They're too advanced for me. Teddy, tell me what to do. Tell me what to do in here. Okay, okay, it's fine. Oh, I just punched something. I'm sorry. I just, you know, ironically, I, I put my TV up on the wall so that I wouldn't hit it when I'm playing VR and guess what I just did? I hit it while I was playing VR. I'm sorry about that. Okay. Let's see, Godzilla, my gosh, you're glorious. Can, are you gonna shoot or anything? This guy looks like the guy from Rugrats. You guys have seen Rugrats. I know you've seen Rugrats. Please, please, hello, hello, greetings. Can you do anything? No, you don't do anything? All right, that's fine, that's fine. Raptor, I think was his name. Oh, oh my, there's an arrow telling me to do stuff. Oh, we got a paper airplane? Can I? Hey! Hey! <laughs> oh, that's great! Oh, whoa, whoa! I'm on top of the, I'm on top of the chair. Oh, can I? Oh, I can draw blue. We don't want blue. Oh my gosh! Look at that. That is so stinking cool. This game is incredible. Okay, I want green. I want green. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna make this. The most magnificent art that you've ever seen. This, look at this, drawing in the lines like a champion. I am so stinking good at at drawing. Don't drop the crayon. Look at this. Look at this art. This is like nothing anyone has ever seen before. I don't need green no more. I don't need you in my life. I need, I need a new color. Where are the other colors? Oh, there we go. Okay, we do want red. Can I, can I get down? Hello? How do I, how do I get down though? I would love to, oh, can I, please, please let me down. Get me down, okay, whew, whew, that was a terrifying experience. I want these, I want red, cause that's gonna be the petals. So put that by the stool, I guess, and yellow's gonna be the middle. And then it's gonna be, oh my gosh, this art is gonna be so good. They're gonna sell it on the, on the art market for Millions of dollars. Millions of dollars, I tell you. It's worth it. It's worth it. You can't buy art like this anymore. This is top-notch art right here. Look at this. Look at the way I'm filling in the petals with the red crayon. So artistically. So artistic. Oh, every inch of this flower is going to be beautiful. It's going to be beautiful. The next Mozart and the next Van Gogh. That's right. That's right. This baby's going places. This baby is going places. Please. We're almost done. We're almost done. Almost there. Got to get this pedal done. Right here. Right here. 
There we go. Just fill that in. Perfect. Get out of here, red. All right, where's yellow? Yellow, there you are. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're the last touch. You're the final touch to this glorious Look at this. Look at this. Tell me that is not one of the most beautiful flower drawings you've ever seen. Tell me. Tell You can't. You can't tell me because you've never seen anything as glorious as this. All right, let's get out of here. That was fun. What is this thing? I can't, I can't pick it up. I can't pick it up. It's fine. Let's play at the racetrack. Can we? Ooh. I like this. I like this. Go. Go, car. Go. 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 Do the, do the car thing. Do the car thing. Baby doesn't know how to. Oh. Oh, wait. Okay. Okay, what if? Oh! What? Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Oh. That was amazing. Can the truck do it? You think the- I don't think the truck is designed. Oh! The truck totally went! Is that the Back to the Future car? Is that the Back to the Future car right over there? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Can we go back in time? Let's go. Let's go. Where we're going, we don't need wheels, do we? Oh! Oh! What? It went 88 miles per hour there! It just reappeared! Oh, check it out, check it out. Watch, watch, watch. watch. It disappears, and then it's gonna reappear, like over here somewhere. Let's... There it is! What? Oh my gosh. This game is incredible. This game is incredible. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, Stuntman. Stuntman McGee over here. You, you, you need to do stunts. You must do stunts. You're, you're facing the wrong way. Look at him popping wheelies! What the heck? Look at this! This is a party. This is a party. We got, we got Stuntman. I mean, what, Evil Knievel. We got Back to the Future car with Doc and Marty. We got just a, a car. I mean, it's a fast car. I don't know what kind of car it is. It's not anything special. This is amazing. This is what a party. Man, I am happy. I am very happy. I'm going to leave now, though. You guys have, have entertained me sufficiently. I've been entertained. Where do we go now? What do we do? Can we plug this in? Let's see. We can... Eh. There. There you go, brother. I'm sure you will appreciate having your night light plugged back in. I'm- I can't blame you. It's scary. Being in the dark is scary. Oh. Oh! I went under the floor for a second there. That was actually terrifying. What is this? Is this Simon Says? Oh, this is Simon Says. You guys know what this is? It- it plays like a, a sequence of colors that you have to press and you have to hit the colors and then you have to follow along. So yeah, it's gonna do blue. I did it. And now it's gonna do blue, green. So we have to follow it along. Now it's gonna do blue, green, and then another one. Blue, green, blue. Bring it, bring it. I'm not scared of you. I'm not scared of you, Simon Says. Look at that, blue, green, blue, green. Bring it. What are you gonna do now? What are you gonna do? I'm, I, I find myself getting closer and closer to it. Uh, blue, green, blue, green, blue. You're really, you're really not changing this up much. Can you make this a little bit more interesting? Oh, we got a yellow in there. All right. Blue, yellow. All right. Come on. How long does this go? Until I beat you. Until I've proven that I'm greater than you. Blue, green, blue, green, blue, yellow, yellow. Simon says. What? What? I find my, I'm getting closer and closer to the thing. I don't like it. Okay, okay, it's getting, it's getting kind of tricky. Blue, yellow, yellow, blue. Yeah? Did I get it? I think I got it. Uh, okay, it's gonna keep going. Oh my. Blue, green, blue, green, blue, yellow, yellow, blue, yellow. Ho, ho, ho! This baby can't be stopped. Can't be stopped. And it's going faster too. That is, uh, um, okay. Blue, green, blue, green, blue, yellow, yellow, blue, yellow, red. Please tell me it's over. I can't do anymore. Okay, we're done. We're done. Let's just see what it does next. 
And back to blue. Okay, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. You do your thing, Simon. You do your thing. I'm gonna go do mine. Whatever that is. Hello, Teddy. Wow, that was interesting. All right, what should we do? There's a toilet. There's definitely a toilet. Babies love getting into trouble with the toilet. What is that? Is that like a lizard plant? Lizard plant. What in the world? I need to, I need to investigate this. This is another sibling's room. This is not our room. I think this is perhaps a sister's room. An older sister. I think we have an older sister. She's got a computer. So she's smart. She's got to be smart, right? People with computers are always smart. Whoa. 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 Come on. What is that? That's a key. You got a little key right there. Can I have it? Can I? Hey. 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 Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I want the key. Stop attacking me. Stop trying to bite me. What am I supposed to do? Can I? Eh. Nope, that didn't work. Here, glasses? You like my glasses? You, you like these? No, you don't like them? Here, have them. Have them. No, I don't, <laughs> I don't want them. How am I supposed to take down this plant? I want the, I want the golden key. Stop! Stop attacking me. Okay, so I just double checked and I'm like way off of the camera. I apologize for that, you guys. Uh, you haven't really seen me or you've seen parts of me. I don't know how to get back. I'm, I'm actually, what I think I'm gonna do is just step forward. And then I think, I think the computer's in front of me here. Okay, I'm in front of the computer now. And that plant is still very angry with me. I don't know what we're supposed to do about that plant. Uh, maybe, maybe we can shoot it with the, uh, the bow and arrow? I'm gonna try. What is that? What is that? What's that noise? I don't... It's a weird noise. Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, we do have the toilet to play around with, but where's where's my bow? Let's go get my bow. Oh yeah, here you are. Here you are. Come to me. Yes. Okay. We're gonna take this back to our sister's room, and we're gonna shoot this stupid plant. Stupid plant. I want that golden key, and I don't know what that golden key is for, but I'd love to find out. Let's see if we can. Eh. Eh. Nope. It goes right through him. So what are we supposed to do here? Maybe if I hit the pot? Wait, I can... Nope, hitting the pot does nothing. I am... I'm confused. That plant, you're a tricky little bugger. And you kind of scare me. You actually absolutely scare me. You're very violent, trying to bite me. Okay, well that's fine. Let's, um, let's see what else we can do. What else do we want to do? Can we go up here? Can we climb this? Ooh, we can. We can play with the computer. Look at me computering. I'm so smart. I'm a smart baby. I'm doing computery stuff. Don't don't look at me like that computer here plug that in Yeah, look at me enter enter. I know that get, go go all the oh What is that? What? What was that? Can I put it in here? Oh my That's different. Oh, we got the mouse too. Um, okay. I don't know how to use this computer, but I do wanna, I want, I want that. I wanna touch it. I wanna touch the electrical globe. Please, please, c come here. Please, can I, hello? I can't, I can't get over there. I can't get over there. I wanna touch it. I can't, I can't touch it. Okay, all right, let's get down. Let's go to the bathroom. Let's go to the toilet. Babies love getting into trouble with toilets, right? That's something that we can do. Oh, wait. What, what do you suppose is inside of that ter terrarium? You think that there's anything very dangerous inside of there? You think we can, we can, oh, we can totally open the drawers. We're using, oh, you know what we're doing. We're using our uh, among the sleep techniques. We got this. We got this. We got the technique. Oh, look, what? There's a little turtle. A little turtle, can I get him? Can I grab the little turtle? Oh my gosh, little turtle, you're free. Be free, be free little turtle. What if we feed little turtle to plant? That, this seems so mean, he's so cute. He's such a cute little turtle. I'm gonna feed him, I'm gonna feed him to the plant. Here we go, we're gonna try this, let's go. Here, have this, eat it, eat the turtle. There, you guys are best friends, stop. Stop trying to bite me. 
I don't like it. Eat the turtle instead of me. Can, oh, wait, I can, I can, I think I can knock over his plant, his, his pot. No, no, it's just him. It's just him kind of trying to, trying to knock it over. I, I don't know what we're supposed to do, though. I'd love to get that golden key. That is something that I'd love to get. You know what? I kind of forgot our other objective was to get the rest of those shapes. We want to get that uh, magical chest open. And uh, I don't know if we've we've seen all the shapes, but let's go into the bathroom. Let's see what kind of trouble we can get in here. Can we flush stuff down the toilet, you think? We got a little boat, a little tugboat. That's cute. Is that a piece of pizza? Is that, that's a perfectly good piece of pizza. Oh, oh, that's disgusting. That's so gross. What a dirty place to leave a piece of pizza and then to let a baby do that. These these parents are not very good. Uh, I got rubber ducky. You go. Oh, bye. Bye, rubber ducky. <laughs> what? <laughs> are you kidding me? Can I flush anything down the toilet, you think? I wonder if I can just, like, grab different stuff and flush it down the toilet. Let's, let's go up here. And does it just, it just pops out. It gets launched. That's crazy. Okay. I wonder if there's anything, like, specifically that we can flush down the toilet that causes any kind of crazy stuff to happen. That would be pretty cool. I do think I see a shape over there. I see it glowing. Glowing in the distance. Come to me, you beautiful little star. All right. There we go. And there's another one over there, I think. I think that was the moon. So let's go ahead and drop this one off. And then I think we only need the circle. I think that's all we have left to find. So let's head back over to this corner. Gosh, we, we've we've explored only like half of the house here. We still have so much more to do. All right, what is this? It's a moon. We got the moon, the power of the moon. All right. So we only need the circle after this. So we, we'll find the circle and we'll just kind of go from there. Go. There we go. We got the moon taken care of. And I think, I think I see it. I think I see. Aha. I do. I feel like I'm swimming. Is this an Atari controller? So we're like living in the 80s right now. This is, yeah, because that's a regular Nintendo. That's the old school Nintendo, if I'm not mistaken. Or maybe it is an Atari. I don't know. I don't know. Grab the triangle. It wasn't the circle that we were missing. It was the triangle. Okay, that's fine. I think this is the last piece. I think this is the last one. But then do we need, do you think we need the golden key from the, the plant? Oh, what? We got it, and we got a green key. I don't know what this is for, though. It's the almighty green key, but I don't know what to do with it. Let's head over here real quick. And I believe that this is our room? This is a huge room for a baby. Why do we have two beds? I guess for one, for the parents to sleep in. Maybe this is actually our parents' room, and we sleep in the same room as our parents. That makes sense. We got another toilet. I don't know if we can actually flush this one, but uh, oh, oh, we can. Oh yeah. National Geographic, hey. Oh no, we can't flush this one because uh, it's closed. We don't know how to open toilet, toilet seats yet. We haven't figured out that skill. We're not quite that advanced in our baby skills yet. Whoa, what is this? Is this mom's engagement ring? You shouldn't be leaving this by the baby crib. Mom, oh. Oh, the green key. <gasps> we we know where to use the green key. Oh my gosh, we gotta go back. We gotta go get our green key. Hey, the little turtle. You've been following me, buddy. Oh my gosh, you're adorable. You're so cute. Oh, you're the best. You're the best. We're gonna name you Ted, all right? I don't know why. But that's going to be your name. Now, let's grab the green key. All right, we got the green key. Let's go use it. Let's see what is inside of this locked drawer. I'm very excited about this. Here we go. Here we go. Go. Open. Yes. What? Cat is that catnip? I got cool sunglasses and catnip. Oh, we have a kitty. We have a kitty. What is it going to do if we give the kitty the catnip? 
I am very excited to find out. Let's go. Plus, we have awesome sunglasses, so that's pretty cool, too. Follow me, Ted. Let's go find the kitty, but don't get eaten by the kitty, okay? Please. I don't know if kitties like eating turtles, but I imagine if they had the opportunity, they might. Okay, kitty. Kitty. I have catnip. Oh, someone left the phone off the hook. You better hang that up. No one's going to be able to make phone calls. Hey, kitty. Hey. Oh, you like... Wait, what happened? Are we just... Are we just best friends now? Or you... I don't... What? Ew! Oh. Wait. There's... Ew, I got... Ugh! Ugh! Here. I got this stuff on my hands. I can't get it off. How do I... Oh, I just eat it. Oh, Gross, baby. Gross. But there is a key inside of the kitty's dish. That's great. I don't know what to do with it. But we found another key. Good kitty. Good kitty. We are back in our baby body. And we're exploring the world around us. Now, one of the things that I discovered very quickly after restarting the game is that it doesn't actually save your progress. So like you can see, our the, the chest isn't opened. Uh, the cat is still mean, he'll still attack us. So we have to get catnip, we have to do all that stuff again. But obviously we're gonna be doing a lot of new stuff as well. Um, you guys have actually provided a lot of tips on things that we can try out. So I'm excited to try a lot of this new stuff. Also, you may have noticed that you guys can actually see me on the camera now. I apologize for the last episode. I, I kind of had the camera in a weird spot where I kept walking off of the screen. I kept just leaving the screen. I think I was moving somewhere over there. It's very easy to forget where you actually are in the real world. So uh, I messed up, but I, I, I turned the camera a little bit this time. So hopefully you guys can see me the whole time. Um, also, you see that? that that's a tip. That's actually a tip for us. So apparently if we give the turtle pizza, he will turn into a ninja. So I'm very excited about that. Now, I actually don't want to be in here. I want to go to our sister's room. And this was a tip that I saw in the comments. Apparently, we can use our pacifier to get the chompy plant over there. Uh-oh. Uh, I should put it in my mouth. Just, just hold on. No, pick... Pick it up, put it in, uh, why do I keep dropping it? Ow, there, okay, it's in my mouth now. Perfect, it's the perfect transportation mechanism. Hey, whoa, here, have that. Oh, you're so cute. Look at your pretty little plant. Now you're not gonna bite me anymore. So now we can get this, which I actually don't know what we're supposed to do with, with this. What are we supposed to do? Put on our cool glasses? Hello? No? No, you put on the cool glasses. There, let's see. Let's see if we can get him to uh, 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 Good enough. Th they look great on you. They look fantastic. You're looking very sharp little plant man uh, We got a Superman in VR book. There you go. All right get off of here and uh, Actually wait, okay put that key down. We got a little rocket launcher here. What we can oh my can we Ugh! oh can we move this around? No, we can't move it around, but that's still pretty stinking cool. Look at that. Oh my gosh, hitting the ceiling. Man, that thing's got some power. Um, let's let's just kind of look around here. What what ooh. Ooh, a secret diary. I can't I can't pick it up. Oh, you know what? Oh my gosh. I think we've done it. I think we figured out what this is for. Oh, this is oh, sister's going to be mad. Oh, what, what, the see, who does she like? Who does she have a crush on? Oh, no. Am I, am I just ripping? Oh. Oh, she is gonna be very, very upset with me, but I'm being a baby. I'm doing my baby thing. This is what babies do. What, <laughs> what are we supposed to do with all this? <laughs> oh, my gosh. What the heck? We're just causing a ruckus. Just tearing out pages out of our sister's diary. We're terrible. Terrible twos. I don't know what to say. Look at this. She drew like a little UFO and a spaceship and stuff. I wish we could actually read what she wrote here. 
I want to see if she likes Tommy. I know she has a crush on Tommy. I've seen it. The way she looks at him. You can't look at him that way. Okay, whatever. This is fine. All right. Can, do you think we can? Oh, my gosh. Oh, I didn't even think about this. Oh, oh, it's so high up. Oh, baby doesn't like it. It's so high up here. This is kind of scary. Okay. All right. We got a UFO. You think you think we can use it like a frisbee? Whee! Oh, that was very bad. Ugh, can I can I get it back? Oh, got it. Okay. All right. No punching TVs this time. Go, UFO. Cool. Awesome. UFO. Ah! No, oh, turn it off. Turn it off. Get, 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 get out of here! Oh! Oh! How does she listen to that ruckus? That is... That is not my musical choice. My goodness. Never touch that radio again. That was terrifying. What is this over here? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Get, get out of here. Ooh. Ooh. You don't suppose we could, like... Oh, she's got a... Uh, what is it called? A terrarium? Oh, my... Oh, my. I just broke her piggy bank. <laughs> Did she have any money in it? I don't know. I don't think she actually had any money in it. Those aren't ants. Those are straight up aliens. Look at these little creepy monsters. Oh my gosh. She has aliens under her bed. Sister, sister, you're up to w some weird stuff. You've got aliens. I don't, ew. It's so gross. I don't, ugh. All right, let's get out of here. I don't like that thing. All right, let's, let's try some other stuff here. Wait, okay, wait, we got, is this baking soda? You don't suppose this is baking soda. You guys know the science experiment, right? You put baking soda and vinegar together and it makes the volcano go. I wonder if we can. Oh, look at this. <laughs> oh man, that's cool. Okay, we've done it now. We, we kind of set off her, her experiment before it was ready to go off. M my bad. Sorry, sis. She's gonna be so upset with us. All right, let's head into our brother's room. Actually, what I wanna do is turn the turtle into a ninja. So let's go get the ninja turtle. He's not a ninja yet, but he will be. We're gonna train him. We're gonna train him to be a ninja. You, you are my pupil and you will learn the ways of ninja. Let's go, come on, come here, come here, come here. Oh, there you are. You're so adorable. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. All right, let's go down and let's go give him the ninja skills this is this is how every ninja is born all right i just I, this is a top secret thing guys but this is the way ninjas are born first of all you have to get a piece of pizza it has to be from pizza hut i'm sorry if you don't have pizza hut then you can't be a ninja you got to find a pizza hut piece of pizza you set it behind your toilet. Now you leave the piece of pizza behind the toilet for three days, three days, very specifically, 72 hours. Now once the piece of Pizza Hut pizza has sat behind the glorious toilet for 72 hours, then you pick it up. No, you don't eat it. You don't eat it. I know, it's hard to resist. It is a delicious looking piece of pizza. No, you give it to the turtle. There. Yes. Yes, my pupil. Yes! Yes! He's been reborn as a ninja! Oh, you're glorious. You're so wonderful. Look at this ninja skills. Watch. Watch him be ninja. Go! Be- Look- Look- Oh, what? Always lands on his feet. Oh my gosh, you're amazing. Do it again. Do it again. Show him. Oh! Ninja Turtle in the house! Oh, you're the greatest thing the world has ever seen. My goodness, my goodness. Across the, should we go all the way across? You think we can get him like into the, the bedroom over there? I don't know, that's gonna be quite a throw. All right, whew, gotta, gotta loosen up, do some, do some pitching stretches. All right, all right, buddy, you ready? Okay, hopefully I don't punch anything when I throw him. Let's go, here we go. Ah, 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 um, Ninja Turtle. Where are you? Are you okay? Are you, there he is! Of course he's okay, he's a ninja. Of course he's okay. <laughs> that is so cool. All right, so I think that we have 
the entire kitchen basically to explore. But one of the things that I want to do is get the key that was in the cat food. I think there was a silver key inside of the cat food. I don't know exactly what it's for, but I have an idea of what it's for. I think someone left a comment uh, kind of alluding to what it's for. So we're going to try and figure it out. But first, of course, we have to get that. And I don't know how we're going to do that. Um, you think we can... You think... Oh, we can shoot. Oh, no, that doesn't... That doesn't do anything. Well, we can... We can... This... This is not... It's shooting a laser, which is cool, but the laser doesn't actually affect things that it hits. So that's not going to work. How do I... How do I drop stuff? Okay, there we go. All right. Uh, ooh, <laughs> 3D glasses. Don't mind if I do... Everything's... Look at this. It's all three-dimensional. My gosh. The future is now. The future is now. All right, get these things off of me. What is this? You think we can... Oh, we totally can. What are we gonna watch? Well, we're watching Bendy and the Ink Machine cartoons. Watching some Bendy. There, that's that's a new character from Bendy, right? There, there's Bendy. That's not Bendy. <laughs> that looks nothing like Bendy. Please drop, drop. Okay, what, what are we watching? It's very strange. This is a strange cartoon. I don't know how to explain it. This man is doing some amazing art. With a dancing cow, a and uh, and Sonic the Hedgehog. That's Sonic the Hedgehog from the 1920s. I promise. That's what he looked like in 1920. Not not very Sonicy. He wasn't very fast. This this is so weird. Okay, we've got to get that star down. We have to get the star down. I don't know what's happening in the cartoon. Hey, Ninja Buddy, Raphael, right? That's Raphael, the red. He's got the red headband. I don't know. I, I, you know, I, I gotta be real with you guys. I was never super into the Ninja Turtles. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I never, I never got into the Ninja Turtles. I, it was, it was perhaps something that, uh, I just, I just never experienced and I missed out. I missed out for it. All right. We got the triangle here. So let's go ahead and, uh, put that there. And then, uh, we still got to get that star down from the TV table. And I don't, really know how to do that. I guess we could try throwing stuff at it. Um, maybe... Ooh, what is this? this is, oh, we got like... Oh my gosh, dude, What? What? Little Game Boy Vision. We got Game Boy... Wait. Wait. Is this like Pokemon Go? Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> what? Look, look, look. Okay, I'm not looking in the, the camera. I'm looking over there. This is a hat. This is a coat rack. Some blocks over there. Watch this. There's something over there. There is something doing flips over there. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Let's go see what this is. It's a little Pokemans. What are you doing? What? Wh how do I... Can I... Can I catch you? I gotta catch them all. I gotta... I gotta catch them all. How do you... How do you think that we... How do we catch them? I don't, oh, we've got to figure out a way to catch the, oh, there, there, I did it, I did it, I, I, I just, I don't know, I think I fed him or something, I just pressed a button on the controller, and it did it, oh my gosh, there's more of them, we have to catch them all, you have to, that's the secret of Pokemon, all right, catch them all, I am the next, Ash, catch him, here we go, get him, oh yeah, we're shooting little orbs of, of deliciousness at them, Oh, look at this. It's a little Pikazard. Look, it's Pikazard. Our favorite, everybody's favorite Pokemon. Pika, Pika. Okay, wait. There's another one over there. All right, let's go get him. <laughs> I can't believe that I'm hunting for Pokemon in a VR baby game. This is amazing. My my earbud just fell out. What are you? You, you don't look so healthy. This is some kind of weird looking Venusaur. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, there was one more by the pen, I think. I got distracted by the weird-looking Venusaur. Okay, I think he was over here somewhere. I think he's behind the pen? It's very hard to crawl with only one hand. You never, you never guess it. Oh. Oh. It's, it's you. It's, uh, it's not Charmander. It's Charminder. Hello, Charminder. It's good to see you. Here you go. We caught him. We caught him all. We call the Pokemon. How? How? Now, what do we do? <laughs> we just shoot orbs, delicious Poke orbs. I don't know. Come on, give me something to do here. 
You gotta give me at least- I, I became the Pokemon master, no? All right, that's fine. Just leave that under the couch for later. All right, let's let's play around with this stuff some more because this is stinking awesome. Let's uh, let's see, this is a game, right? This has got to be a game. Can I? How do I? Okay, maybe maybe I need to eject that, and then I can get this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, it's not working. It's not going in. Maybe maybe it goes in the top. No. What is this then? Oh wait. Maybe this is an Atari game. Maybe? I don't... I don't know. I don't know. I can't... I can't get it to work. Please. Please. I want to play the games. I want to play the games. I want to play video games. You can't take this away from me. I'm like right in front of my desk. How did I end up here? Oh man. I just hit my desk. <laughs> Sorry. All right, all right, doesn't look like we're gonna be playing any games. I don't know how to make the games work, but I do want to figure out Ninja Turtle, can you, can you get the star for me? You think you can go up there and get it for me? Here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw you up there, and then he'll, he'll walk back to us, right? So he'll, he always comes back to us, so I'm, I'm gonna see if he'll knock the star down as he walks back to us. Please, Ninja Turtle, where are you? Where are you, buddy? Oh, no. Ninja Turtle! Ninja Turtle, what happened? Oh, gosh. Okay, you know what? I forgot that I can just stand up. I'm so dumb. Okay. There. We can just do that. And I lost Ninja Turtle. So, hopefully he comes back. I really... I don't know what happened to him. He's been lost forever. I don't know if he got absorbed into the television or something. I'm very sad now. But let's take our star over to our magical chest here. Okay, what's left? I think, like, the moon? And I think the moon's over here. It's over by, uh, by the weird little beaker thingy ma bopper. Let's, let's see, what, can I, oh, I can totally pick you up. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do with you. Okay, we got, we got the moon. Is there anything behind all these books? Just get rid of all this stuff. Just doing baby stuff, you know, you know how it is. Just. Just throwing stuff all over the place. Oh my gosh, what a mess. What a mess. Can I... Uh, I'm getting a little too close to the wall there. Okay, you know what? Let's, uh, let's go back down. Crawl mode. Let's take our moon over to the chest. And let's, uh, I think that's the last one. I hope it is. I don't know, though. Yes, that was the last one. Alright, good. So now we have the green key. Which we take to the bedroom, I think? And this is where we get the catnip. And then once we have the catnip, we can feed it to the- Ooh. Actually, we can go up on the couch. I didn't realize that. What is up here? <gasps> car keys! What do you do with car keys? I don't know. Can we set off the alarm? Maybe. I don't know. I'm gonna throw it off the couch for now. Oh. Oh. There's no fishies in here, though. <laughs> I want the fishies. We need fishies in here. I don't know. Alright. Well, I'm not gonna worry about that too much right now. Let's go back down. Grab the key. Alright, let's head back into the bedroom here, and let's see what we can find. Let's just see what we can find. Alright, here we go. Get that going. Yes. Stand up. And we get the catnip. Okay, just set that down over there. We also can get on top of the bed. I don't know what kind of- Ooh. Oh, we got a horse head. That's- that's nice. Squeaky horse head. Let's play some Jenga. Boom. I win. I win? Did I win Jenga? I don't know, let's go back down, grab the catnip. Can we actually try to- do you think we can actually play some Jenga? Let's see, let's see if I can... Just very... I wanna get this one? Okay. Oh, no. Careful, careful, careful. No, 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 no! Wow, I am bad at Jenga. Okay, good. Well, we tried, we tried. No losers in this house. Only winners. I'm gonna set the catnip over there for now. Did we go into the bathroom last time? I think we did. I don't know if we did that much exploration though. Can we, uh, can we check out what's going in the bathtub? What's going on in here? Anything? Can I? Oh boy. Oh. Can we, you think we can plug up? <laughs> We're making a bubble bath. You think there's a way to plug the bathtub up so that it floods over? That would be kind of messed up. I don't, I don't know if we can do that. All right, let's go over here. Um, I think we already went on top of the toilet. Let's see how much we weigh. How much do we weigh? We weigh 
that much. Okay, good to know. All right, I might have to hit the gym later on. All right, get rid of that National Geographic. There's a bunch of trash in there. How about toilet paper? Anybody need this? Here, put it on the... No, you gotta put it on... This is where everybody puts their toilet paper, right? They put it on the the little uh, holder thing. That's not that's not a plunger. It's a it's a holder. It's a toilet paper holder. Here, let's put that in the trash. There, perfect. All right, brush our teeth real quick. Oh, put some lipstick on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now I'm real pretty. Okay, and brush our teeth. And brush. And brush. Remember, you gotta do circular motions. Circular motions. We've seen it. We've. That's what the dentist said. Here, put the. Put the uh, toothpaste or the toothbrush in the bathtub. Perfect. All right. We're doing good work here. We're doing good work, guys. All right. Let's grab the catnip. Take it over to Kitty. Whew. This game's a workout. I feel like I'm, like, swimming. It's like I'm constantly swimming. Okay. All right. So, I don't think I did this last time, but basically, if we get close to the kitty, he'll, ah, he'll whack at us. No. Bad kitty. But, if we give him this, a nice kitty. Yes. Good kitty. Good kitty. Nice kitty. All right, so we have to eat the kitty's food so that we can get the silver key, which I'm still not positive what to do with this, but I have a theory. So I'm just going to leave it over here. Now, we have a lot of kitchen to explore here. We got a little RC car. Oh, can we? Wait, okay. How do I? How do you? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, come, come on. Come on. Oh, okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Go through. And then go through. No, no, no. Back up, back up, back up, back up. How do I back up? Back up. No, you gotta back up. Here we go, here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Oof, this is hard. This is really hard. Okay, got that one. That one. Turn around. Oh, we gotta back up. Okay, okay. All right. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. Oh, this is so hard, but kind of awesome. Okay, turn that way. No, 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 no. Oh no. Oh, I'm 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 messing it up. I'm messing it up. Oh, get in there. Oh, go, 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 go. Go! Oh, I failed. I failed the race car challenge. Okay, we're gonna have to try this again. We gotta try this again. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Alright. Just can we reverse into it? We can. We could totally reverse into the rings. Awesome. Okay, there's one. Get this one over here. Here we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, go forward. Go forward. Yes, good. Good, baby racer. Excellent. This is what baby driver was actually about. We did it. We did it. But we have to do it again? Do we have to just keep doing it? Or is it just, do we just get the chime? Is that, is that our victory? Oh no, it's getting harder, I think. Actually, if I keep going, let's, let's see. It, it's changing. It is evolving. Okay, wait, 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 no, 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 okay, turn that way, yes, yes, like that, there we go, okay, now we gotta get behind the table, oh my gosh, this is getting intense, I can't even see the race car anymore, I gotta back up, and go forward, okay, okay, get in there, there we go, there we go, that's what I'm talking about, oh, little race car driver, here we go, here we go, all right, turn, turn the wheel. No, 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 no. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Whew. All right, my hands are getting tired. Whew. Let's try this. Okay, turn, turn the wheels that way. There, good, good little driver. Good. No, I didn't finish it in time. Shoot, that is really, really hard. What is this, candy? Nuclear candy? I just ate nuclear candy. My gosh, I'm going to turn into a three-armed baby. That's amazing. Oh, peanut butter and jelly? Sure, don't mind if I do. Some cake? Yeah, I'll take that. Ow, ow, give me all the cake. Mmm, some milk with that? Mmm, all right, that's good stuff right there. More candy, more candy. Here, here, get, clean that up. Clean that up, Mom. All right, eat all that candy. We need more sugar in our diet. That's, that's what the scale taught me. Mmm, fruit? Ah, sure, why not? I'm a hungry baby. Eat the, eat the... <laughs> I just hit myself. <laughs> oh man, eat all this fruit. I, I don't care, I eat the peels too. The peel's the best part. Here, have a banana peel. There you go, kitty. Have a banana peel. One more. There's one more fruit up there. Mmm, mmm, that's an apple. That's a good apple right there. Can I play around with the microscope? Can't play around with the microscope. There's our family. 
See, we do. We have a brother, a sister, mom, dad, and there's me in mom's arms. Yeah, I like it. Okay, let's get back to what we were trying to do with the silver key, I guess. Yeah. All right, let's go back. I think it's in the brother's room. There was a locked chest, and I, I believe that it was a key that we need to open it up. I just don't know if this is actually the key that we need or if it can actually open. We're gonna try and figure this out. Let's go in here. Gosh, there's so much stuff in this room. This room is so cool. I wanna have this room one day, hopefully when I get big enough. All right, yes, that was it. All right, stand up. What is inside? No, nope, we gotta get a little bit closer. Okay, oh, a cowboy hat. Can I, oh, can I put the cowboy hat on? No, there we go, I got the cowboy hat, sweet. Now I'm looking good. Um, what? Can I, can I shoot this thing, you think? How do I, maybe, oh, nope, nope, that's not how you do it. Uh, oh, oh my, oh my, so much power. Oh, does this thing have infinite ammo? Oh, ho, 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 ho. I like this, I like this a lot. Take that, Dumbo. Oh man, can I shoot these trophies off the, oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna cause all kinds of mayhem with this. This is amazing. I want the helicopter. Give me the helicopter. Come on. Knock the helicopter down. How do I get that helicopter? I want the helicopter. I'm knocking it the wrong way though. I'm shooting it in the wrong direction. It needs to fall towards me, not away from me. That's what I'm talking Here we go. No! This is a football. We got the football, but I want... The helicopter! I don't know. I give up. I give up. Alright, let's 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 put that down for now. Now this guy. This guy. Someone told me that if we put this guy on this platform, apparently he's gonna fight with Riptar? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh! What? That was amazing! That was amazing! Oh my gosh! Do it again! Do it again! Fight! That is so stinking cool! <laughs> oh man! That is awesome! Alright! We got some more toys over here. It looks like there's like little robots? What are these? They just kinda walk around on their own? There's another one over there. It's right over there. Uh, we can do anything with the tank. Oh, do you think we can put the tank on the track? Let's just try that real quick here. Let's put that guy down there. Get this, put that back together, and then put the tank. Come on, tank. You know you want to. You're too big. Ah, tank's too big. All right, that's not gonna work. That's fine. We got a baseball glove. Do some, play some catch with ourselves. Look, oh, so much fun. We. Oh yeah, okay, enough of that. What are you doing back here? What, what are you, why are you so mad? Why are you so mad? Get out of the way. Here, I'm gonna hit you with a bat. Hit you with the bat. Here we go. Let's play some baseball. Uh, nope. I didn't quite get it. All right, hold on. Here, try this again. Huh. Uh, nope. Nope. I'm, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this. Uh, I'm, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Nope. It's not gonna work. <laughs> it's too hard in VR. I can do it in real life. I promise. I can hit a ball with a baseball bat. I promise I can. Can we draw on the walls? That was something that my wife said I should have done. Oh, we totally can. We totally can draw on the walls. Oh, we're gonna draw a happy face. Stop, stop getting closer. I, I need to put my arms up in the air. Okay, here we go. Okay, and then, uh, oh no. Oh, it's getting, it's getting kind of icky. That doesn't look like a happy face at all. That looks like a deformed face. I'm sorry, sorry. Can we draw uh, over our brother's art? No, we can't. I kind of had an idea, an idea, if you will. Now, it's a little sinister, I know, I know. This little guy is up to no good, but I, I wanna try something and it, and it kind of evolved from an idea that I had the last time we ended up playing Baby Hands. Um, also, we're gonna be trying some other things. I, a lot of you guys were saying that I should put this in the VCR. Now, that makes no sense in my baby head, but no, that doesn't work. It doesn't, I don't. I don't know how to play this awesome game. I mean, well, you know what? Actually, there I think I have this toy. I think I I, I think in my pen, 
I have that little onion, but let's not worry about that right now. The thing that I kind of really want to do as little munchkin man here today is try to flood the house. I'm going to try to flood the bathroom, namely. Um, last time we did discover that we can, we can actually turn on the water here, right? And we can get the bath going and we can give it some, some bubbles, right? And we can give it some bubbles. But what if we just started filling the bathtub up with just stuff, basically, from all over the house? Now, if I go over here, can I grab that National Geographic? I can. Okay, can I get it? Ah, I got, I got to get down. Okay, I want to put it in the bathtub. I'm going to put it in the bathtub here. So get up there and then drop it in the bathtub. Ooh, can I, can I plug the hole? I don't know. It's not enough yet. We need more. We need more stuff. So we're going to be basically filling that bathtub with as many objects as we can fit in the bathtub. I guess. And we're going to see if we can get it to spill over with water. So, uh, we'll, we'll do some lipstick. I think someone said that you can draw on the walls with the lipstick. I'm going to try. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Causing all kinds of chaos here for mom. Oh, just, uh, there you go, mom. There you go. You can clean that up later. You can clean that up later. There we go. All right, good, good. So we, oh, and we're getting it on the floor too. So let's just toss that in the water. Let's make sure that it, perfect. That's where it belongs. All right, let's grab uh, some toothbrushes, right? We got some toothbrushes. Uh, let me see if I can grab those guys. Okay, got that one. Yeah, that one. All right, all right. Uh, let's see if we can get it in the bathtub from over here. Hui! Oh, look at that, left-handed. I'm right-handed, so it's, yeah, not as good. Not as impressive there. All right, let's try that and just toss that in there. Perfect. Okay, so we have a mission. We have our mission, and uh, if we find any other stuff along the way, we'll we'll definitely play around with it. Uh, we got we got some rings. Why don't we just like throw stuff into the bathroom? I think that's going to be an effective strategy. We got some dice underneath the the cabinet here or the drawers, whatever you want to call them. I'm just going to throw everything next to the bathtub or at least kind of close to the bathtub because being a baby and carrying stuff around is very, very difficult. In case you were wondering, it's very hard to move around as a baby and throw all and, and, and carry all these objects. So what I'm going to do is just throw them <laughs> as close as I can get them to the bathtub. And that's going to be my strategy here. So I'm going to get very tired. I can tell already. My arms already getting tired throwing this stuff across the room as a small child. My arms have not developed into the pitcher that I will be in the future. I'm going to be a baseball superstar. You guys, you guys are going to see it. I'm going to be a musical superstar, an artist, right? Baby Mozart over here, baby Van Gogh. And baby, I don't know. I don't. I don't know enough about baseball to tell you a pitcher's name. So I'm. I'm just gonna stop there. But I'm gonna become a crazy, uh, super skilled baseball. Actually, speaking of baseballs, there's a baseball right up there. I kind of. I kind of want to get it, but I don't know how. Okay, you know what? Let's let's grab this stuff. Let's get this stuff. I mean, we got enough Jenga blocks, right? We got enough Jenga blocks. Let's get. Oh my gosh, that throw was amazing. That was amazing throw. Can we get this clock? Oh yeah, oh yeah, okay, that's very loud. Please go to the bathroom. Thank you, oh. Oh, it's making a very upset noise. Okay, do you think I can get this phone? I don't know, like my, my little guard thingy is right here, so I'm scared I'm gonna hit something. I'm, I'm definitely gonna hit something. Okay, how, how do I, oh, you know what? I can stand up. Get the phone, yes, yes. I got the phone. All right, good. So I can go back down and let's just, ugh. We need to put the phone where it belongs, which is in the bathtub. Perfect, perfect. That is a crazy looking phone. That is a huge, is that actually, I think that's a cell phone. I think that's a cell phone from like the late 80s, early 90s. Yeah, that's what cell phones used to look like. I know, it's crazy. All right, let's get dad's slippers over here. Yeah, let's grab these guys. Get those. Oh, you think? I almost got it in the bathtub from over here. Let's see. Let's see if we can do it. Ugh! Oh, I hit the... Hit the... Hit the door. Okay, well, that's fine. 
That's fine. Is there any other stuff that we can... Oh! Oh, can we... No, can we... Can we get... Can we take any of this stuff? We can't take any of this stuff. I didn't realize we can open the drawers. We can totally open the drawers. Oh, we got a back massager. Perfect. Get that in the bathtub. That's gonna do really well in there. Nope, can't open that one. Okay, that's fine. All right, uh, can we... Well, can we open these drawers? We probably can't open these drawers because they're blocked by the door. Let's try. Nope, can't open them. Okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's get all this stuff in the bathtub as, as best as we can. My, I'm telling you, my arm is genuinely tired. It's very, very tired. So, we're just gonna throw all of these Jenga blocks. I don't like the Jenga blocks. There's too many of them and they're not big enough. So, we're, we're, I don't know if we're gonna get all these Jenga blocks, especially those ones that are over there. But we'll get the ones that are in the bathroom into the bathtub. I think that's gonna be... A, a, a well enough accomplishment here. I'm, I'm telling you, my arm, my arm is very tired. Again, have not developed these arms into the picture that I'm gonna be in the future. So we're still, still working with little baby flabby arms. What is this? Oh, it's the clock. Oh, get, get in the bathtub, get where you belong. There you go. Very good. Dad, shoe. Oh man, mom and dad are gonna be so happy when they come home. I just hit something. I don't know what it was. Okay, let's uh, let's get mom's ring in there. It, it was looking a little dirty, so I figured it needs a bath. Let's get that that horse head and the back massager, and I think uh, I think that's everything that we wanted to try. That noise is so annoying. All right, so let's go get some more stuff. What do you suppose we can find to throw in the bathtub? I mean, we do have all these blocks. But again, they're kind of like the Jenga pieces. There's just so many of them, and I don't want to move all of them into the bathroom. Because keep in mind, the further away we get from the bathroom, the longer it's going to take to move objects into the bathtub. So, um, hello. We'll put that over there. I do want to get that baseball, though. Oh my gosh, how are we going to do that? I guess we got to try and get, like, our, our brother's little shooty gun thing that we got out of the chest, but in order to do that, we have to get the catnip. I don't know. There's a lot of steps to it. I don't know if I'm going to go through all those steps. Let's get the Game Boy over there and uh, the weird Pokemon game over there. Okay. Uh, a VHS tape should go in there. Oh, I'm stepping on my cords. Okay, get that over there and grab this guy. Yep, yep. You're going you're gonna to love it in the bathtub. Sure, we'll put a gun in there. No, let go. I gotta... Eh, no, I can't... I can't throw it. I can't throw this. Okay, well, that's fine. Uh, we can we can manually carry it. <sighs> I don't want to carry it all the way over there. That's annoying. I don't want to do that. All right, get some of these blocks. Again, we're not going to get all of them, but we will... We'll get some of them. So, I'm just going to throw these guys as close as I can get them to the bathroom in Mom and Dad's room. Okay, so there's actually a room that I don't think we've we've actually discovered yet, or at least explored, and that is the laundry room. I don't think I've ever made it into the laundry room. So, let's go into the laundry room, see what kind of trouble we can get into here. Um, it looks like we got the washing machine. Can we, can we? Nope, can't do anything with it. We got a little mouse trap. Ooh, this seems, this seems very dangerous. Ah! Ho, oh, oh, ho, okay. Um, that didn't feel very good. Just got attacked by a mousetrap. Whoa, is that a monkey? Is there a monkey in there? Hey, little monkey. Come here. Hey, little guy. How you doing? You're going to go take a bath. You're going to take a bath. And it's going to be wonderful. You're going to love it. So what do you suppose we do with this mouse trap? We need a mouse. We need to get... I mean, that seems kind of malicious to put a mouse in a mouse trap, But it seems like the only way to get the cheese. Can't get the cheese. Keep getting... Getting smacked. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. So let's take a little monkey. Hey, oh man, this guy's gonna be kind of tricky to get back to the bathtub, but we definitely want to get him in the bathtub. All right, I'm taking monkey all the way to the bathtub with one hand. This is like a survival mission right now. We gotta save little monkey man. The only way he's gonna survive is if we get him into the bathtub. We're fighting our way to the bathtub with only one hand. It's, this is the most miraculous baby monkey save the world has ever seen. You guys are gonna experience it firsthand. Here it is, here it is. Save him, save him from himself. There, 
There, go to where you belong to excellent, excellent little monkey man. Now you're in the bathtub where you're nice and safe. Let's see how the bathtub's looking. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That is a good looking bathtub right there. I would love to take a little dip. Let's see. Can we, can we get, oh, we're in it. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're in the water now. Oh, I love this. Splish splash taking a bath with my little monkey man. Little monkey guy. Yeah. You love it here, don't you? You gotta, you gotta stay above the water though. You might, you might have some br breathing issues if you stay under the, okay, it's fine. He's fine. He's totally fine. He loves it here. All right, we got some more stuff that we can throw into the bathtub here. So we will. We absolutely will. Uh, we got, what, what, more of these blocks. It looks like we got another little Pokemans thing over here. Uh, we got a uh, little horse head over there. That's not a horse head. That's a cow head. Uh, let's grab this stuff and try to get it over to the bathroom. So we'll just toss it over there. Left-handed throw, not too bad. I should start using my left hand because my right hand is very tired now. It's very, very tired. Get that in the bathtub, come on. Oh, come on, these throws are getting so lame. So lame, this is not the pitching way. Here we go, here we go, okay. That's what I'm talking about, get that guy in there and get that in there and we'll just throw these in for good measure. You know, because they're here. We don't want them on the floor. We want them in the bathtub. Perfect. I'm getting a workout. I'm getting a workout. Okay, we got this cool hat. So we can put that in, in the bathtub later. Uh, can we get the umbrella? Ooh, we totally can. All right, we can throw it like a javelin. Hui! Okay, that didn't work at all, but that's fine. We'll take that over there later. Um, what else? Oh, rubber ducky. We have to get a rubber ducky in the bathtub, of course. Can we actually turn on this bathtub over here? I never really thought about that, but... Oh, we totally can! So we could have filled up this one with, uh, with all our toys as well. Which, actually in hindsight, probably would have been a lot smarter because it's not on the other side of the house. It's kind of a more central location, so it would have been a lot easier to get everything over there, but you know what? We've already committed to the bathtub in the other room, so that's what we're gonna do. Can we get this one all soapy? Yeah, we can get it all soapy. Get the soap in there. There you go. Bubble bath for everybody. Where is this kid's parents, honestly, causing this kind of chaos? Ooh, a basketball. We definitely want to put the basketball in the bathtub. Ooh, we've also got an Etch-a-Sketch. I like those. Oh, look at that. <laughs> that was great. Uh, can we actually play around with this thing? Can we, uh... Can we, let's see, let's, oh, what? Okay, can I, can I, can I draw though? Like, can I, please, let me, let me, can I do, no? It's not gonna let me draw. Oh, the Etch-a-Sketch, I can, I can like erase it, but I can't, I can't actually draw with it. That's very upsetting. Okay, fine, you're gonna go in the bathtub. You're gonna get cleaned up. Little astronaut man? Yeah, Wh whoa. Whoa! That is awesome! He's got a little jetpack! There he goes, off into space, also known as a bathtub. He's gonna go take a bath. Oh. Oh. Wait, wait, can we actually control this little guy? Hold on. Hold up. Hold up. Oh! I can control him and then can I... Can I rotate him though? I don't know how to... I don't know how to make him, like, turn. I, I don't know if we can actually make him turn, but we can control his little jetpack action. Oh, look at that! That is so stinking cool! Here, can I... Can, can, go, go, like, a different direction! You're going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way, man. But what we can do is we can use our newfound ability here to get him across the living room. Wait, wait, wait. I need to line it up. I need to line it up. So we're going to travel him all the way across to mom and dad's room. Look at this. He's going to be a little speck on the screen once he gets all the way over there. He's already getting pretty small. <laughs> He's pretty far away. I, I can't really see him, but you can see how I'm controlling him. Every time I press down on the trigger, when I close my fist here, he flies up. So when I let go, he drops back down, but he continues moving in the direction that you let him go in. So he's going, he's going where no man has gone before to, to the bathtub. Okay. I think he's far enough. I think he's made it. He's going to make a nice landing. 
Nice gentle landing. There he goes. All right. He made it to mom and dad's room. Perfect. Now, one of the things that you guys wanted me to try since the last episode is uh, to see if we can break open the alien terrarium here. And this scares me because I don't want little aliens being free, but we're going to try here. Ah! No, I'm covered in piggy bank. No, I want to... No, I, I don't think we can... I don't think we can mess with it. I think that the aliens are forever inside of this this cage, which is, I, I kind of prefer. I don't want them getting out. I don't like them. They scare me. Can we take sister's backpack? Can we, can we get her backpack? No, we can't take our sister's backpack. Okay, that's fine. Um, are there any other objects that we really want to put inside of the bathtub? Again, remember, it takes a while to get stuff over to the other side of the house. Uh, oh, you know what? Actually, let's check these cabinets or these drawers here. Let's see, just close. Uh, she loves, she loves sloth spaceships, you know, sloth astronauts, as everybody does, and unicorns. So, good, good. I, I like our sister. She has good taste. All right, let's get our bunny slippers. Let's see if we can get those over to the bathtub. That was a nice throw. Yeah, well done. Let's grab her sneakers, too. We'll get her sneakers over there as well. Let's just get those tossed over there. All right, so the Etch-A-Sketch, of course, we want to get that into the bathtub. Let's head over to our brother's room, and let's see what we can find here. Can we actually take the frog? Can we get a little frog? No, we can't, but can we give him a little top hat? Oh! Look at him go! <laughs> I wish, I really wish I could put you in the bath. You look so sad. Look at how sad he is. He just wants to get in some water. That's it. Give him a top hat, give him some water, and he's the happiest frog in the world. All right, that, that was fun. That was fun. Uh, let's get our rubber ducky, of course. He's the one. He makes bath time so much fun. We're gonna get a soccer ball for the bathtub. Um, can we take Dumbo with us? I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, maybe your name isn't Dumbo, but you're, you're the most notable elephant that I know. So you're gonna be called Dumbo from now on. Uh, we got some robots. Uh, definitely wanna get these guys involved in bath time. So let's go ahead and throw, uh, that's terrible. Terrible, terrible throw. I think there was another robot somewhere over here. I think, yeah, he's angry. He's such an angry... Oh, oh, I can't pick him up. I can't... I can't pick up this robot. I can... I can, like... Ah! I can kind of, like, swat him around, but... It's very disorienting. Okay, forget it. Forget it. Angry robot's not gonna take a bath. That's fine. You stay dirty and stinky. That's the life you're gonna live because you choose not to come with me. Okay, we're gonna get a baseball bat, of course, and we're gonna get Little Blue Robot, and I really wish we could get Dancing Frogman into the bath, but we can't. We can't move him around. That's fine. We're gonna get Dumbo over here. Again, I don't know if that's your name, but that's what I'm gonna call you. Okay, so we have a lot of stuff that we need to get, wow, that throw was fantastic. But we have a lot of stuff that we need to get over into that room. Holy cow, look at that. What an arm. I'm telling you, this baby, he's going places. All right, robot, you go over there, get his sister's shoes, get an Etch-A-Sketch, sure. Get another shoe over there. Uh, what do we got? Rubber ducky. You're the one. Come on, get over there. Oh, that was a bad, bad throw. That was a very, very bad throw. We got some bunny slippers, of course, and we got a soccer ball, so we want to get... The soccer ball. Oh, it's going to bounce. Ah! Okay, where did the basketball go? Oh my gosh, the basketball ended up all the way in the kitchen. That is not where I want my basketball to be. I want it to be in the bath. That stupid Dumbo blocked the soccer ball too. What a jerk. Oh, this thing. We want this thing. This is actually the chicken waffle logo. These are the guys who made the game. This is their logo. It's very strange looking, but I kind of love it. Look, see, he's wearing his VR headset. He's in it. He's in the game. All right, get... Oh, no. Oh, no. I, I threw it on top of that table. Oh, that was very bad. All right, well, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Oh, I did want to check. Can we actually go into the refrigerator? That would be interesting, right? Oh, what? We can. Is that pizza? Is that the pizza from last night? Is that the pizza that we left behind the... Behind the, uh... The, the toilet? 
We got some chocolate covered strawberries, right? No, just regular strawberries. Oh, okay. I'll eat some strawberries. What is this? Meatballs. We got some olives. What do we got here? Zucchini? Cucumber, maybe? This is delicious. Can we open? Oh. Oh, we got some veggies in here. Oh, man. We're getting our veggies. Is it? Is this eggs? Whoa. 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 What? Did that egg just explode magically? Was that a magical exploding egg? Wait a second. Let's... Oh, firework eggs. That is... <laughs> It's so cool. I love it. How many are there? Are they just infinitely replicating? We got magical firework eggs up here. This is amazing. I'm so happy that I went into the into the refrigerator. We got some Chinese food. Can I? No Chinese food for me. All right. Uh, what's this? Is this lemonade? No, no lemonade. What I just eat? I don't know what I just ate. Can I eat these? No, I can't eat magical eggs. No eating magical eggs. Can we drink some juice? Nope, can't drink the juice. Okay, that's fun. <laughs> that was actually really awesome. I'm glad we did that. Now, what were we doing in here though? I think we just got kind of distracted. So let's head back to our, our original mission here. We gotta get as many of these objects into the bathtub. All right, let's get all this stuff over to the bath. We gotta get these slippers over there. We gotta get the umbrella over there. That was a bad throw. Let's see if, can I just crawl with this? I can. This one is really hard to throw because it's just awkward. Are you, are you okay, robot man? Here, there you go. There you go. Stop making annoying noises. Wait, what happened to my umbrella? Umbrella, what happened? Oh my gosh, the umbrella like went under the floor and actually disappeared. I lost the umbrella. Okay, that's very upsetting. I'm very sad about that. But let's get our ducky into the bathtub. Did I get him? I think I got him into the bathtub. That was awesome. Let's try that block. Eh, it's a little off. Here, let's fly Spaceman into the bathtub. Go take a bath, buddy. You got this. You got this coming in. He's coming in hot. Oh man, he's gonna splash down in a be beautiful, glorious fashion. Here he goes. Oh, no! <laughs> Oh, he hit the edge of the bathtub. Oh, I'm so sorry, spaceman. I'm so sorry about that. Here, let's let's save him. Save him. Get him into the bathtub. Here we go. Here we go. We got this. We got this, buddy. You're gonna fly right in. Nice and gentle. There you go. Splash into the bath. All right, sister slipper. Get that over there. We also have the etch a sketch, which I must have thrown it really, really well because uh, I was not expecting it to be all the way on the other side of mom and dad's room. Let's just get it into the bathroom. And then uh, we got another block over here. I do want to try and get that baseball, but I just don't know if we can get it with what we have right now. I mean, we could try to... Oh, what? First try? Are you kidding me? The pitching superstar over here. Yeah, we got the skills. We got the skills. I hope that uh, someone wrote on this ball. We need to clean it. We need to clean it off very, very quickly before dad gets upset. So let's throw it in the bathtub so that we can wash off that writing on the baseball. No one wants people's writing on baseballs. That seems ridiculous. You got to keep your baseballs nice and clean. All right, get all this stuff in the bathtub. Oh, I can't wait to see what it looks like in there. It's going to be beautiful. Mom and dad, again, they're going to be so happy that we're doing this. They're going to be so grateful for all the hard work that we're putting into cleaning all these, all these toys. We're cleaning their shoes. We're cleaning all these items that seem to be very important to them. And it's good that we're keeping them nice and clean. So let's just throw all this stuff as close as it can get to the bathtub. All right, get that robot. Yes, robot, you're gonna love it in the bath. All right, is that it? Was that everything? Oh, we still gotta get the basketball and the soccer ball over here. So let's just kinda Gently throw those. That was nice. All right. Get the baseball bat. Just throw that. Oh, nice throw once again. And let's grab the basketball over here. And I'm just trying to... How did the umbrella end up over there? What? Okay, we do have to get the umbrella into the bathtub. So first, just get that nice and gentle. And then let's head over here and grab our umbrella. And I don't know if we want any of these toys to be... In the bathtub? I don't think so. I don't, I don't, I don't want to 
throw these toys in the bathtub. They're nice and clean already. I slobbered all over them, made them nice and clean with my slobber. So they're they're fine. They don't need to go in the bath. Hit this basketball. Ugh. Hit it. No, nope, that's not working. All right, fine, fine. We'll just uh, we'll just do it the old-fashioned way. We'll just get this umbrella, walk it right up to the bathtub, and then just. Oh no 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 no! Come back, come back to me. All right, get in there. No, 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 come here, come here. Okay, there, there, we did it, we did it. Get these blocks in there. That robot, he is, he's really putting up a fight. He does not want to take a bath, but I'm telling you, you're gonna love it once you relax for a second. All right, get that in there. Okay, whew, we're almost done. My arms are very, very tired. I'm getting quite a workout from playing this game. Okay, so we just have the basketball, I think, and, uh, Dumbo, it looks like. It looks like that's pretty much it. And that's all of the objects that we have been tasked with cleaning today. Let's get, uh, come here, come here, stupid basketball. Okay, there we go, let's check it out, let's go up. Oh my gosh, oh man, what a mess. What a mess we have created, and it's beautiful. It is a beautiful, beautiful mess. I wish I could get Dumbo over there, but I can't. I can't reach him. Oh, rubber ducky. Maybe, maybe I can reach Rubber Ducky. Come here. There you go. Oh, there we go. All right, we can get this block too. Okay, perfect. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna try to get Robot Man to stand up so he doesn't make all that noise. There we go. See? Don't you love this? Don't you love it? Here, take, here, ride off into, into the bath. Come on, go. Go. Just, oh, you need a little bump? Little bump. He doesn't actually move. He just stays in place. He's like moonwalking. All right. Well, that's pretty impressive. Ah! Stop making noises. You're underwater. How are you still working? It's incredible. Waterproof clock. Well, unfortunately, we weren't able to cause a flood. Uh, we couldn't plug it up. We couldn't quite plug it up. Try putting all these objects, like, right on the drain. But it's, uh, it's not working. It's not working. Get the baseball in there. It's like a perfect fit. It's a perfect fit. Look, plugging it up perfectly. It's not working. <laughs> it's not working. This is the infinite drain. It always drains. You can't stop it. You can't stop it. But at the very least, we we definitely got to clean up all our toys and some of our parents' stuff. I'm, I'm really glad about the baseball. I was really worried someone wrote on it. So rude. But we were able to clean that up. We got, we got like a monkey in there. We got Dumbo, of course. He doesn't quite want to get in the water. He seems pretty upset about being thrown in the bath. But I'm telling you, you, you need it and you're gonna love it once you just kind of embrace it. What we're mainly focusing on today is some of the speculation that's been going on in the comment section. I've been seeing a lot of comments about uh, some secrets here in the world of baby hands. Apparently... We're, we're, this is all just speculation, and, and how true it actually is, I have no idea. So we're mostly just testing theories today. But apparently, there might be a secret way to open the front door. To actually be able to go outside, which would be very, very cool. So there's a lot of theories going around the internet right now on how to do that, and if it's actually possible. So we're gonna test some of those theories today, which I'm very, very excited about. Some of the things we've actually already done, but uh, we'll try them out with maybe this new update. We'll see what happens. I'm I'm excited, to say the least. So, let's go on our journey here and uh, try to figure out how to get that door open. Now, first things first, we need to... Okay, this this was actually one of the things that we need to, to try out is uh, completing the uh, the arrow shooting game here, but it's not it's not working. What's going on here? Why why is the arrows just disappearing? There's there's something wrong with this. Oh whoa. Okay, okay. All right, we need to. Oh, oh get it, get it. Oh okay, try again, try again. Okay, so we're I actually didn't want to do this, but we're doing it. We're doing it anyways. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh my. Oh no! <laughs> that is very hard. Okay, we'll do that later. That was definitely one of the theories that was going around, was that we need to complete that minigame. I don't know. Um, but we need to try just like the brute force approach, right? We need to just see if we can reach the door handle. Can we? Uh, 
Uh, oh no! It's just out of reach! Oh, use those baby hands! Just stretch, little guy! Just stretch! I can't get it. I can't get it. Oh man! Okay, we can't reach the handle, but we can make other things reach it, right? We can try to... I don't know. I mean, this is definitely the most brute force way to approach it, right? Just throw stuff at it. Just throw stuff at the handle. Okay, I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think it's gonna work. All right, let's try to beat the arrow shooting minigame here. Let's, let's try this out. I'm gonna get a little bit closer so that I have some nice shots. Okay, you gotta pull it back far enough. That's what I was doing wrong. Oh my! I did not expect them to be right here. Oi! Oh, okay, okay, okay. Can we get a two for one? That would be pretty sweet. No, come, no! It's okay. Let's, yeah, there's a two for one right there. Okay, we got that one. All right, where are they gonna pop up now? Oi, hey, you're right in front of me. Oh my gosh, you're right over there. Is there another one? Oh, they're back there. Oh my. Okay, we gotta, we gotta reassess our, our, our location here. My gosh, they popped up behind the couch. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get those, but we'll try. Here, let's hit that one, hit that one. Oh, there's another one over there, and there's two over there. My gosh! Okay, 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 I can I can do this. I Maybe I need to do it like this. Yeah, let's, let's try this. Okay, got that one, got that one, get that one, and oh, those ones are so tricky. Okay, maybe we should start with those over there. Get those guys. Get that guy. Oh my goodness, that is very hard. I can do this. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, come on, baby. You can do this. You are the Robin Hood of the living room. I believe in your abilities. Can I hit? If I hit the balloons, I think that if you hit the balloons, it fails automatically. Let's just test it out here. Come on, come on, shoot, buddy. All right, hit the balloon. Yeah, cause the cause the target falls to the ground. It it like you totally fail right away. Whew. All right, just take a deep breath. You've been watching the Olympics. They don't have arrow shooting in the Winter Olympics, but that's okay. The Summer Olympics are are gonna show up eventually, and you've watched enough of those. You can you can do this. Embrace your inner Robin Hood. No, you have to actually shoot. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna try it right-handed. Maybe maybe that's what I'm doing wrong here. Maybe I should be pulling back with my right hand. Maybe, ooh, this is actually a little bit better. I, I just, my aim is a little off, but I feel like I can shoot a little bit more rapidly. So let's try. Ooh, ooh, oh, I was so close there. Okay, we're on to this. Let's go. Get that guy, get that guy, get that guy, get that guy. Oh, okay, watch this. Rapid fire right here. Bam, 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 bam. Missed that one. I missed that one target. Oh, that is so frustrating. I missed it again! I keep missing the one on the other side of the couch. Oh my gosh. Here, come on. There we go. No! Baby Robin Hood, why have you failed me? This is it. This is the one. I believe it. I believe it. I believe. No, I missed it. And I hit the other one too. All right, come on. You! Got him! Got <laughs> Holy cow, finally, my gosh. Okay, is it gonna change again? Is there more to this? Oh, there, there is. There is, there's another one over there. Okay, we kind of need to get in the center, I think. Uh, let's, let's try. Let's get that one, that one. There's one over there, and one right there. Did we get them all? Did we get them? Oh, there's another one that I didn't even see. Okay, we need to look around for this other one. Let's see, let's hit that one. No, no, you need to get shot. There's one there, there's one there, there's- Oh, it- in the baby pin. Oh my. Okay, so there's actually four of them. All right, we're gonna have to rapid fire this. Let's go. Boom. Boom. Missed. 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 So many misses. Okay, that was a good start. That was a very good start. Here we go. 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 Baby Robin Hood. Yes. Yes. Yes! Who is the champion today? This guy right here in his baby hands. That's right. Okay, did we do it? Nope, we still haven't completed it. Oh, that one is tough. Okay, there's a big one over there. Is there any more? Where's the... Oh, there was another one behind the couch. Maybe if I like go like right here, this might be a good spot. Let's try again. Let's see. 
Okay, there's one over there. There's one over there. There's one way the heck over there. How am I supposed to get all of these? This is very, very tricky. Okay, maybe if I back up a little bit. Maybe if I go, like, right here, I have a better sh shot at it. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, there's one over there. I just punched my headset. Oh, my gosh. Those shots are too far. That's too far. All right, I'm gonna try it. I changed my angle up a little bit. This is really, really hard. This one is... I hope this is the last one, because... Look at these shots! They're so far away! I really gotta get on my A-game for this one. Alright, got that one. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, I missed that one too! Oh my goodness! Come on, baby. God, what is happening? What was that? Why, why did it just... Okay, come on. Come on, work with me here. There we go. No, no, no! It's, it's too far. It's too far! Okay, maybe if I get a little bit closer... A little bit closer. We'll try here. Get that guy. Get that guy. Got him. Get you. And you. You're the last one. You're the last one. You were supposed to die. Okay, at least we got the angle right. I think that we're, we're on to greatness. There. Nope, I missed it. <laughs> okay, I was not expecting this to be this hard. My goodness, what do we get for this? This better open the front door. My gosh. Are you kidding me? I hope this is the last one, because th wh what? What even happened there? I don't even know what happened. Oh, we did it! Holy moly! Oh my gosh, is that the last one? No, it's not! It just keeps getting harder and harder! Oh my gosh, there's too many of them! Okay, all right. We've got to do this. We've made it this far, but my goodness, this is hard. Gonna try scooting back a little bit here, because, man, this one is very, very hard. And, oh, they're so far away from this distance, though. Are you kidding me? Maybe if I stand up. I hadn't even considered that. If I'm standing, I can maybe... Uh, this is not working. <laughs> did not work. That was worse. But I think that by standing, I can get a better view, at least, of the living room. You gotta go rapid fire. Look at this. Rapid fire. It's not working. I can't do it. Oh, this is so frustrating. Okay, I was very close last time. I missed that target right there, but I hit every single other one, but I missed that one. That is very frustrating, but I feel like I can do it now. Here we go. Here oh, that was bad. Oh, that's so bad. Just restart. Here it is. This is the one. You guys are gonna see it from beginning to finish. Oh, no! I missed. I didn't pull back on the arrow. Oh, that's so frustrating. But we're, we're on to it. We're on to it. Yeah, like that? Oh, missed that one. That's, that's, you can't miss. You absolutely cannot miss. If you have to take two shots at a target, you already failed. Come on. Come on, little guy. There we go. That's, what, oh, I missed one. I missed that back one. See? If you miss one, it's over. But we are getting very close. Gotta go a little bit faster. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, that was so stinking hard. Wow, I am so glad that is done. Is there more? Oh my gosh, you've got to be kidding me. There's more. There is so many more. All right, here we go again. Okay, let's get a lay of the land. There's one over there. So there's one right there. There's one right there. And then there's two over here. This one isn't that bad, actually. Did I just beat it? I think I just... I... Th I think... It, they're gone. The... The targets are gone! What?! I think we just beat it. I think we just completed it. Let's try... To shoot the door handle, maybe? No, that's not doing anything. Oh my gosh. All that effort. It didn't do it. It wasn't what we needed to do. So we need to test more theories. This is not working. <laughs> well, at least we completed the uh, little Bowman challenge. That's pretty sweet. I'm happy about it. It just, it didn't do what we were hoping it did. Let's try some more theories. Now, one of the other theories was to put the train from the pen and also the race car over there onto the track that's in our brother's room and basically get all of the vehicles that can go on it going at the same time. That was one of the theories. Actually, oh, I want to try this out. You guys were saying 
that we can get the cheese from the mousetrap if we knock over the broom? Is that right? Now let, let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, there you go. Okay. I like that. So now we can now we can get the cheese. I'm not sure what we're supposed to do with the cheese, but now we have it. Can we can we eat it? We can't eat the cheese. Okay. Well, I don't know what to do with the cheese, but now we have it. I'm just going to set the cheese down over there. Maybe maybe the kitty likes cheese. You like cheese? No, nope, don't like cheese. Okay, that's fine. Uh, so let's take the race car. Oh, you can't take the race car. Oh, do we have to? No, because we can't pick it up. We have to be able to pick it up and put it on the track. We can't actually pick it up. Well, that's a little frustrating. I also saw there was like a little microscope. There's a microscope here. Has there always been a mi microscope here? I don't actually know. Can I go back up? I want to go back up. I want to look in the microscope. Can I look in it? Oh, look at the little weird looking cells and whatnot inside of the microscope. There they are, amoebas. Here, here, check it out, kitty. It's very fun. You should check it out, it's cool. All right, fine, just keep drinking the milk off the floor, fine. Okay, so we can't put the race car on the track, but we can take the train. We'll try taking the train over to the racetrack. You guys were saying that it should work. I don't, I don't know. I've never tried it, let's go. All right, so we need to put the track back together, of course, we'll put this guy there. And, oh wait, is this new? I don't think this was here last time. Yeah, does it do anything? It's like a Lamborghini or something. Uh, it doesn't look like it does anything special. I like how the other ones do special stuff. Okay, let's try putting the train on the, it's not doing anything. <laughs> the other car's pushing it. That's great, I love it. Go, push him, push him, keep going. Okay, so the train doesn't actually work on the track, so. I guess that theory's kind of out the window because the train and the race car both can't go on the track. That's kind of upsetting. The The big truck can go on the track though, right? He just launches off into the trash can though. That's that's pretty funny. I wish that he would make the turn, but I guess not. Wait, where did, where did this one come from? Seriously, where did that car come from? I didn't put that there, did I? Isn't that the Knight Rider car? The one that talks? To David Hasselhoff? Okay, well, that's that's interesting. I, I have no idea where that car came from. Maybe it came out of the semi-truck? I don't know if I missed it. I don't know. That's weird. Let's get the DeLorean on there, though. Go back to the future, DeLorean. There you go. Oh, man, that is so stinking cool. And then we want to get Evil Knievel, of course, on the track. So now we have everybody that we know of are on the track. Look at this. It's a party. It's so stinking cool. I love it. I don't know if there are any more vehicles. If you guys know of any more that can be added to the track, let me know where they're hiding and we'll try it out in the future. But it doesn't look like we're gonna be able to add any more to the existing track. It's actually getting pretty full. There's a lot of cars going on. <laughs> look at them all going. I love it. Oh man, this game is so cool. Okay, so we have to check on the door. Let's just see. I don't, I don't think that that did the trick. Whoa, it's Godzilla, it's Reptar. Taking down the city. Okay, that's cool. I don't know if that did the trick though, um, because, wait, is there a scuba diver? Is that new? I don't know. Uh, nah, it didn't look like that worked. Okay, all right, well, we're just, again, we're just testing theories. And that was one of them, the scuba diver. I don't remember you, little, whoa! That is so cool. Okay, we gotta, we gotta try this guy out. Let's, let's see if we can get the water going here. He's gonna take a little swim in the bath. Oh, wait, you wanna go in the, oh my. Oh, wow, that was impressive. Come back here. Let's go in the bathtub. I wanna see you swim around. Oh, I love it. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> you're doing a figure eight. I'm going back and forth. Oh, you're so awesome. Here, have a ducky. Mr. Ducky, enjoy your bath, scuba man. Oh, so in the last episode, we were trying to plug up the bathtub. One of the things that you guys said I should try doing is sticking the plunger on the the hole in the in the bathtub, the drain. But the problem is, is that you can't actually pick up the plunger. Oh, you can. What? I didn't think you could pick up the plunger. I okay. Well, we're gonna have to try it then. Let's let's see if we can stick the plunger. Oh, did I just put the plunger on my head? I did. I am wearing the plunger on my head right now. That is um. That's disgusting, because I know where this plunger has been, and I know what it's used for, and now it's on my head. Okay, that's that's a lot of fun. Here, let's just, let's, let's see if we can put it right over the drain. 
I felt like we couldn't move the one that was in mom and dad's bathroom, but I guess I was wrong. I guess I didn't try hard enough, but it doesn't look like it, it works. Whoa, what happened to Ducky? Ducky, oh no. Hey, he's okay, he's all right, he's made of rubber. Um, so yeah, it, there's no way to, to plug up the bathtub. It's very upsetting, oh well. No way that we know of, that is. I still can't believe how long that arrow shooting challenge took. My gosh, that was difficult. Okay, now the next theory was that we need to put the Ninja Turtle in the bathtub. That was that was one of the theories. We've, we've put him in the toilet. Have we done the toilet thing? I don't know if we've actually put him in the toilet, but a lot of you guys were saying, try putting him in the bathtub and that might unlock a secret. I don't know. We're gonna have to try it out. Let's grab little Ted. Ted is what we named you, right? Yes, my name is Ted. Okay, see? His name is Ted. All right, let's give him his ninja pizza. All right, Ted, you stay there, and then we'll get you your pizza. Don't you worry, little buddy. Don't you worry. You're gonna turn into the most super-powered ninja ever. Here you go, buddy. There you go. Here he goes. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle right there. All right, so we're supposed to put him in the bath. All right, let's put him in the bath. Oh, Ted. You're a turtle, you're supposed to be swimming. If you're okay, don't say anything, okay? You're good? All right, I think he's good. Let's check the door here real quick. Let's see, it, actually, it looks like it creaked open a little bit. No! Oh, uh, Ted, why did you disappoint me like this? I'm very upset now. Okay, we're running out of theories to test, you guys. I've only got a couple more. There was another one, I guess if we take the squirt gun, there was this idea that if we shoot the calendar, th this is, I have not tested this. If we shoot the calendar, it'll start raining inside of the house. And for some reason that'll open the door. I don't know, I, I wanna find out. So we've got the squirt gun here. Where's the calendar though? I don't, I don't know where the calendar is. Maybe it's in the kitchen. That's probably somewhere where I would put a calendar. I ain't scared of you, kitty. I got water now. What? What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do? You're gonna do nothing. You're not even gonna react to me shooting you with the water. Okay, fine. Fine. You're really into that milk. Whatever. All right, calendar. Calendar? Calendar! Let's see. Let's see if we can, if we can shoot it. I don't know if this is working. We're gonna try here. Get a little bit closer. A little bit closer. Maybe we have to stand up on top of the, on the chair here. Maybe we shoot it like that. Come on, it's supposed to start raining. It's supposed to rain. Shoot the family. No, shoot the carrots. No, that's not working either. Can we get up in our in our little eating thingy, my Bob? It was a high chair, right? This is not working. This is not working. Where, where did this theory come from? I wanted to make it rain inside the house so that it opens the front door and we have to escape. I was really counting on you working, you stupid calendar. You're broken. You're, you're a broken calendar. Here, have the... How do I drop the gun? Okay, there we go. We dropped it. Okay, there's soapy bubbles over there. Has there always been soapy bubbles over there? I'm not actually too sure, to be honest with you. I don't think we've ever tried to get on top of that counter. Is there a way to get on top of that counter? Also, the phone is up there. The phone used to be hanging down, I thought. Uh, let's see if we can get up on our high chair here. We can. And we get- oh. Yeah, some baby food? Can I- I can't open the jar. It's, it's too hard. It's too hard. I haven't learned how to use my thumbs yet. Oh, oh, okay, we can't do it. Let's just throw it. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry, kitty. I did not mean to actually hit you with the jar and break it on your back. That seems very, very bad for you. Uh, let's eat a carrot, though. Ow, ow. Can I eat the carrot? I can't eat the carrot. I want to eat the carrot, the baby carrot. Okay, I can't eat the baby carrot. Fine, just throw it off. That's what babies do. Can't eat it? I'll throw it. So is there a way to get on top of the counter? Can we do the whole like among the sleep maneuver? Can we open the drawers to climb on top of the counter? That would be pretty sweet, right? Whoa, I'd never open these. Uh, what? There's soap, there's bubbles coming out of this soap. What? How have I not done any of this? How could I have missed all this beautiful, beautiful stuff? This is actually extremely dangerous. A baby should not be playing with cleaning supplies. Here, we're gonna clean the refrigerator. It's real dirty. It's really dirty. Have these cleaning supplies always been down here? Cause I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. There's a toaster up there too. I don't know if we can get to it. Can we open up this cabinet? We can, there's more baby food. Just give me all that baby food. Ah, just eat it off the floor. Ah, ah, ah. That's disgusting. What, weird baby. 
I don't know what we're supposed to do with this. I like how there's bubbles coming out of it, though. That's fun. But uh, one of the other theories was to put the monkey... This is so weird. Why would this do this? I don't know. I don't even know if we can open the oven, but was to put the monkey from the dryer into the oven. And I don't know if we can actually open the oven. It seems like a very dangerous thing to allow a baby to be able to open an oven, but we're going to try. We're going to take you to the oven. We gave you a bath last time. This time you're going into the oven. You're going to get cooked up. All right, buddy? Don't take it personal. What, what did I just eat? What am I eating? I just ate. Am I eating soap? Am I eating the bubbles? Oh, nope. I'm not eating the bubbles. I, I'm... Oh. What was that? Is there something up there? There's something... There's something going on. What is going on? What? Oh, okay. Oh, excuse me? Can I... Is there... Hello? He hello? What is going on around here? There's something eating something. It's not you. I had you in my hand. Something was up there. What is going on? It's not Ninja Ted, because Ninja Ted's in the bathtub. I'm kind of scared. Okay, you know what? We're going to try to open the oven. Come on, open. You can't open the oven. Guys, it's not going to work because you can't open the oven. It's got child safety locks on it, which is probably the only responsible thing that our parents have done. Otherwise, they're pretty poor parents leaving us alone here in the house with chemicals and whatnot. Right, Monkey? He agrees. Okay, so what in the world is going on? We got pans. Oh, I love me some pans. Babies love making noises with pans. Have you ever given a baby a pan? They love it. It's like their drum set. It's a wonderful thing. But I don't think that's gonna get the front door open. I, I don't think it's gonna work. I did it. There was something up there. Do you think that there's a mouse up there somewhere? Do you think there's a mouse eating our food? I really don't know. <laughs> I, I kind of want to find out, but it stopped. It stopped. When I opened the fridge, it stopped making the noise. So I don't know if it's actually in the fridge or not. I don't know. We might have to save that for another episode. Let's see if there's anything going on in here. No, nothing in there. Can we open these taller drawers? No, we can't open the taller drawers. We can't do the whole among the sleep drawer platforming. We should be able to do that. We've learned that babies are very, very capable of climbing drawers, but we can't do that here for some reason. It's very upsetting. I want to get up there. I want to figure out what's going on up there. Okay, so the final theory that I've got here is using the little ball gun shooter thing to just kind of shoot your way into the door. I really, I'm skeptical about that one, but it seems like a, a nice idea. Unfortunately, it's gonna take some work. We're gonna have to do some work because we gotta get a chest open and then we gotta use the key to open up the locked door in mom and dad's room. And then we gotta get the catnip and get the cat to get away from the, the dish and all that stuff. So let me get that all taken care of. Oh, also, I just wanted to show you guys real quick. I guess there's a new tape here with a new cartoon, apparently. Let's see if it's this one. This might be the... Yeah, yeah, this is new. There's a little mouse. There's a little mouse. Wait, I wonder if this is going to give us any kind of clue about the mouse that's causing trouble in our house. I don't... I don't know. I love this, though. Like, he's running away from his own shadow. That's great. I don't know. I might be reading into this way too much. This is just probably just a fun little cartoon that's here on our TV now. I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Let's get back to trying to get the big old shooter gun. So just as a side note, it seems they moved the star. I think the star used to be on top of the TV stand over there. They moved it over to this corner. I was having a hard time finding it, but I eventually found it. There you are. All right, so this should be the last piece. And then you should open up, we get the greed key, now we gotta take this over to mom and dad's room. The cartoon's still going, we got like a cat, I love you, the, the mice are running away from the cat, I don't know what's going on, it's crazy stuff. Okay, we got the catnip, so let's take this over to kitty cat. Here you go kitty! Oh yeah, enjoy that, I'm gonna eat up some of your food, alright? Oh, we can't, can we not eat anymore? Can we not eat the food? I feel like it's not... It's not working anymore. It's so weird. And I have a bit of a problem here. I can't eat the food out of my hands and I can't put it down. I can't put down the cat food. Can I wash it off of my hands by going into the bathtub? We're gonna have to try because otherwise I can't pick stuff up anymore. <laughs> that is very frustrating. Let's try. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. We were able to get rid of 
the clumps of cat food. But we can't eat stuff anymore. I wonder if they don't realize that something that they changed kind of broke it. Or there's something wrong with my headset. Maybe, I don't know. But now we should be able to grab the key out of the kitty's bowl and then head over to our brother's room. Okay, here we go. Get this open. And actually, I just remembered another theory that we need to test. I don't think it'll take very long. But let's go ahead and grab this, so now we can shoot that thing and knock stuff down and all that fun stuff. I love this gun. This thing is the most awesome gun in the game. But let's take it over to the living room and we'll just try shooting the heck out of the door. Open! Hit the, hit the handle. Hit the window? Maybe if we hit the glass? Oh my gosh! None of this stuff is working. That is very, very upsetting. Maybe if we hit the switch up there? I'm getting closer. I don't think I'm gonna be able to hit it. Well, I think I kind of did hit it there and it didn't really do anything. Well, we certainly tried. Now, the one theory that I almost forgot about was uh, with the astronaut. So apparently, there is a secret for getting the astronaut on top of the moon, on top of the shelf there on the globe. That is gonna be very, very hard. I didn't even realize how small the moon is. How are we supposed to get that little guy up there, maybe if we knock it down, or maybe if we put him in the rocket ship, I don't know. I don't know how that works. Let's go grab the gun and see if we can knock the globe off of that shelf so that we can just set the astronaut on top of the moon because I feel like flying him up there is gonna be an absolute nightmare. All right, let's try shooting the globe off of, oh my gosh, it is just, it is stuck there. Oh, and now I moved the moon. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay, well, let's try hitting the rocket ship. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's take the rocket ship and see if we can put the moon man inside of the rocket ship. No, that didn't work. Okay, we're gonna try this. We're gonna try to fly him up. Up, 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 up. Go higher, buddy. Go, no, that wasn't high enough. Oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that. Do you really think that's something that you need to do? That seems so hard, but I don't know. I want to hear what you guys think. But I think that's going to do it for our theory testing here today. Let's put on the astronaut helmet. Can we? Oh, this is so cool. What? <laughs> this is fantastic. We are going to outer space where no baby has gone before. But guys, that's unfortunately all of the theories that I have available right now, and unfortunately that door is still very, very closed. I had an idea for something that we could do, and I thought it would be a lot of fun. We've basically been given, you know, full domain of the house. Our, our parents are gone, our brother and sister is gone. I don't know what's going on in this house. But what's one of the things that you do as a kid when you're bored? And, and quite possibly one of the things that you do when your parents aren't home. I was thinking, you do the floor is a lava challenge. That's actually something that we've done in Hello Neighbor, which was a lot of fun. We kinda had to use our imaginations, and we're gonna have to do the same thing here in Baby Hands today. But I was thinking, we're gonna have a challenge where we can't touch the floor. Now, one of the rules that I've set up here is that our baby pen is an island. We're safe here, there's no lava here. But everything else, everything else around here, that's all lava. That's not wood, that's lava. You die if you touch it, you burn. So yeah, we're just, we gotta be careful about that. So the idea is, is that we need to have some kind of mission to accomplish with the lava challenge. And I was thinking, I think what we need to do is we need to save monkey which, actually, the monkey's over there. We need to save the monkey from the washing machine, and we need to take him into our sister's room. We need to bring him to the top of the bunk bed. That's basically our escape ship out of this lava challenge. That's how we're gonna get out of here, is our sister's bunk bed. So essentially what we have to do is get to the washing machine, pull the monkey out of the washing machine, and then take him back with us to our sister's room without touching the floor. Y yeah, uh, that's gonna be really tricky. Now, one of the rules, basically the way we're gonna do this, because you can't jump. We can't jump as a baby. We're a baby, we're crawling. We, we don't have those motor skills yet. We haven't developed that kind of ability yet. So so what we're gonna have to do is use objects, and the idea is, here's, here's how the rules work. Basically, you can put your hand 
on an object. As long as your hand is on the object, you can use that object to move yourself across the lava. So what we have to do is we have to take objects and place them strategically in different spots, and then we can safely put our hand on the lava. And we're gonna have to do some stretching too. Like, I might actually punch my walls several times throughout this entire pro project, this whole, this whole challenge. The objects around me are at great risk because, for instance, like right now, we're using Octopus Man to protect us from the lava. I, I want to use the top over there to, to protect me, so I'm gonna stretch across and grab the top. So, you really gotta reach. You really have to reach. We're gonna use this block over here. So, what we can do, though, is we can kind of place objects in our path to use them as stepping stones to get across. So, that's basically the rule set that I've set up here for the Lava Challenge in Baby Hands VR. I'm very, very excited. Sometimes my hands might slip off of the object that we're holding. Don't hold me accountable too hard, all right? We're gonna try our best using the rules that I've set up. I still think it's gonna be fun. I still think it's gonna be like a fun little challenge. So basically what I'm doing now is just littering our path with objects that we can use to protect us against the lava. So I'm just kind of building myself a pathway to the kitchen. And I think that's good enough for now. I think what I'm going to do is take some of these blocks and throw them off in this direction. We'll probably be using a lot of these blocks to protect us from the, the treacherous lava that is right below us. All right, let's do it. Let's try. Okay, don't roll away. That's kind of a scary thing. If it's a round object, it just rolls away. Okay, so we're just going to use these objects to make our way across. I think we're going to use Octopus Man to kind of bridge the gap here. I don't know if that's going to work. We need it a little bit closer. Okay, there we go. All right, let's grab this one here. There we go. All right, Octopus, you're coming with me. One of the things that you can do with the Octopus that I haven't done before is you can stick him to, like, the wall. If he if he lands the right way, um, he'll he'll stick. He'll stick to stuff. All right, let's... Let's try to reach for this one. Whoa, okay, all right, we got it. We got, actually, I'm gonna take this block with me and just get to this one here. All right, all right, we're on our safety island. I want Octopus Man again. I just, I need you. I, I want to stick you to the wall. No, no, come, come here, come here. All right, come on, come on, stick. No, you're supposed to stick to the wall. Come on, why isn't he sticking? He's not sticky. Maybe I just need to... I just need to place him. Oh gosh! Oh my gosh! We kind of got a little away from the object we were we were using as an island. That's gonna happen from time to time. Forgive me. We we may have just died in the lava, but I'm gonna give myself an extra life here. All right, I'm gonna use the train. Uh, oh man, we are in kind of a tough situation here. How are we gonna get into the kitchen? We don't have a lot of objects to use, um, other than these blocks that are around us. So. I think that I'm just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to make do with what I've got here. So, let's do that, and then, hmm, I need another, I need another block. Maybe I can use Octopus over here? I'm gonna switch hands. Alright, switch over here, and then place that guy there. And let's do that, right there. There we go! That's what I'm talking about. Alright, okay, I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit worried about this. Train, you come with me, and just get over there. And, uh, whoo, all right, we've got a block over there. Oh, man, this block is, like, right on top of me. Okay, grab this block, this stretch. All right, good job, good job. All right, we're safe, we're safe. I'm gonna grab the the RC car. I'm gonna use the RC car. Maybe, maybe what I can do is actually, I'm gonna switch hands here, grab this, we'll use that, okay? We can't pick up the car, that's right. Okay, so we need more objects. We definitely need more objects to protect us from the lava. Let's grab, all right, we stretched, okay, good. So, there are things, are there stuff in here? No, there's nothing in there. We, we need to stay on our train. Uh, there's, there's nothing in here, so we need to close that. All right, protect me, protect me, train. Uh, I do want to get into that cabinet, because that's where all, like, the cleaning stuff is, and we can use those to protect us. Here, here, we can use this. All right, get this. All right, come on, come on, little baby guy. Don't fall in the lava, all right? All right, oh, I just got hit in the face with a cabinet. Okay, that didn't work out very well. All right, oh, no, no, no. Safety, safety, I'm safe. You have like a three second rule with, with the lava challenge and baby hands. All right, I know I'm making the rules as we go, but you kind of have to, because this is, 
This is a new thing. Hey, we got a sponge. That's gonna cool down the lava around it. That's nice. Okay, disaster averted. We saved ourselves. All right, grab this. No, no, I don't, I don't want to hold it. I just, I just want to, I just, ah, so many chemicals. No, I want to, no, 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 don't back up. No, don't stand up. I just want to drop it. How do I drop it? Please, please put it down, baby. Oh my gosh, we just, we're, we're pressing the wrong buttons and it's causing us to basically die. We, we have died. We, we have to start over. We have to start over. I hate to say it, but this thing killed me and I can't drop it. I can't actually put it down. It's just, I'm just backing up. All right, let's go back to our start point. We got to make our way back from the start point, our safety island here, the lava free zone, and we got to make it back to the laundry room. All right, finally, I got it out of my hands, and now I picked it back up. I, oh, okay, all right. Careful with those bottles, because what happens is... To drop them, you have to press the back button on the controller, which also makes you back up. And so if you do that, you fall into the lava and you die, you bird, stupid baby. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm taking out my aggression on the baby. He is an innocent bystander. He's just, he's fallen into this world that is full of lava. What in the world was that? I did not know that the sheep did that. Does the owl do something weird when you throw it? No, he doesn't do anything weird. Little radish man, he doesn't... Yeah, he doesn't do anything. What about Piggy? No, but the sheep... Oh, the pig actually sounds really funny when he squeaks. Um, I'm just throwing some of those objects over there so that we can have them. All right, here we go. Round two. Let's try this again. All right. Oh, no, no. Okay, grab this one. Grab this one. Okay, get on there, and then go to this one, and then go to this one. This is a big gap here. This is a problem. This is a problem, you guys. All right, I'm gonna try to grab this one. All right, there we go. And then I'm gonna use this to bridge the gap right there. Okay, kind of rolled away, but I think I can reach it if I just stretch a little bit, a little bit. There we go. All right, all right, all right. Grab this one. Okay, we got a little sheepy. I want to see this thing go again. <laughs> what in the world? That is so weird. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. All right, grab Radish Man. You're gonna be my safety net. There you are. All right, Miss Piggy, Mr. Piggy, whatever you wanna call him. Uh, okay, he, he is a ball, so he's kind of rolling away. So let's just try to get over. Oh no, I'm hitting my boundary. I'm, I'm scared that I'm gonna hit something. Here, stay there, Miss Piggy, and I'm gonna use you. Yes, all right. I'm gonna use you to get over here, and then we're gonna Reach around the corner here, grab this guy. I'm getting very close to my my border. I'm kind of worried that I'm gonna hit something. All right, we made it back to the cleaning section. Of course, we don't wanna pick up those cleaners anymore. I don't wanna deal with them. Um, but what I do wanna do is grab the dishes that are over here, cause they, they're gonna work really well as protection against the lava. So let's, let's just kinda stretch our way. Come on, grab it. Grab it, there we go. All right, grab the, grab the plate. Perfect. Oh, no. They're not gonna work very well because they break. Oh, I didn't think that one through. Okay, let's not use plates. Let's definitely not use plates. Let's use trains. Trains are definitely much better. Grab the train. Okay, train, there you are, there you are. Protect me. Soap, you're my next safe haven. Perfect. All right, let's, let's see if maybe we can, okay. All right, is there anything in here that we can use? There, There is vegetables and fruit of some sort. Uh, I don't think we can grab those things. And I am hitting my wall. I am hitting my wall over there. So I don't know if we can actually use that area. Um, this is this is getting very, very tricky. I think we might have to get some more objects over here. I feel like we're running out. I'm going to use the broken plates, but... Uh, we definitely need some more stuff to actually make our way into the laundry room. Like we're kind of running into a block here and uh, I'm not sure what to do. All right, baby, use that. All right, there we go, there we go. All right, use the plate, the plate island and stretch. Stretch a little guy, there we go. I'm just gonna bring this a little bit closer. Okay, all right, so what I need to do is get more objects kind of closer to the kitchen and throw them further down that way, so behind me, so that I can get into the laundry room. So let's, let's try to do this. How am I gonna get back? I need to get, I need Piggy. Come here, Piggy. Oh no, there's a wall there. 
What am I gonna do? Uh, oh, Radish Man. Radish Man, come here. Yes, yes, protect me. There we go. All right, use the sheep. That's what I've always said. When all else fails, use the sheep. All right, there we go. Nope, nope, grab that. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're safe, we're safe, we're safe. Grab more of these blocks. We need so many more of these blocks, and we're gonna just chuck them over there as best as we can. And you know, I was just thinking, we have to escort the monkey to our sister's room. That's gonna be really hard, because we can only use one hand. I guess we're just gonna have to, like, throw him and then pick him up and then throw him again. That's basically what we're gonna have to do. It's gonna be tricky. It's gonna be tricky, but I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna cop out on the lava challenge here. I wanted to make something that's actually a challenge. So that's what we're gonna do. I just hit the cat. <laughs> Sorry, kitty. Sorry. All right. I think that I have enough stuff over there in the kitchen. So let's use the blocks that we have left over here. And again, we wanna kind of bridge this gap. Actually, I shouldn't have taken that. I should have used it. I guess I'm just gonna use this one over here. All right, get to the next section. All right, pull myself over there. There we go. There we go. All right, good, good. So now we can take a lot of these objects and just kind of toss them over that way. Let's grab this thing over here. Oh, I hit something. I'm hitting something. <laughs> I told you because of all the like the stretching that I'm going to have to do to reach objects that are kind of outside of my reach. I'm going to hit stuff in the real world. I knew it was going to happen, but hopefully everything that's around me is prepared for me to punch them in the face with a Vive controller. OK, we've made it back into the kitchen. Do we have enough stuff, though? I don't I still feel like we're kind of lacking in the stuff department. Maybe that'll work. Oh my gosh, I threw that way too far. All right, let's just let's just try to kind of create ourselves a little pathway here. Maybe we can use the soap. Yeah, let's. Okay, okay, okay. Use the train. Grab the soap. Uh, let's let's actually let's throw the soap. No, throw the soap. Oh, throwing the soap is like impossible actually. So okay, just do that. That works. Okay, use this. Okay, grab the s or use the sponge and then and then grab the sponge and throw it over there. I think we're almost oh my gosh, we are so stinking close. We just need like one more object. What's in here? You think there's anything good in Oh. You think we can use the baby food? It's going to break, but if we set it down kind of gently. Ooh, I like this. I like this. Oh, broke that one. Okay, you know what? Just kind of push it, push it along. All right, and then and then use the baby food, and then throw the sponge a little bit closer. <sighs> I guess we could do this. It's risky because now we're kind of stranded out here. All right, I think we can make it though. I think that we can do this, and then we just need to, we just need to open that. Just stretch a little bit more. There we go. Okay. Grab the monkey. Come here, monkey. I'm gonna save you, buddy. Come here. Oh, oh, there he is. There he is. We saved him. We saved him. All right. Now we're gonna throw him over there and get back to where we were. Yeah, I think that's gonna be the best route. All right, we're gonna use this. We gotta kind of hopscotch our way back to where we were and then grab that and then grab the sponge over here and just just kind of use that to get back to the soap. You think we can do it? Here we go. Okay, careful, careful. All right, all right, there we go. <laughs> there we go, it's working. It's working. Monkey, I'm coming back for you, buddy. I'm coming back for you. I'm gonna get you back to our sister's room. I promise you, I promise. All right, come here, come here. All right, I'm gonna throw him. Okay, don't, don't go too far over there. I don't want you getting too close to the kitty cat. Kitty cat can be very, very mean. All right, all right, we need to, we need to put a little, Little bridge there. All right, come here. Come here. Okay, go. No, 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 no. Be free. Be free. Okay, that wasn't a very good throw, but we're making progress. We're definitely making progress, and that's what counts. All right, go into the baby pen. Yeah, go to safety. We need... No, stop. Go. There. Okay, I just need a little breather. I need to get back to my island so I can assess the situation and figure out what we need to do next. All right, monkey. How you feeling, buddy? You doing okay? You're much cleaner than you used to be, so I'm very happy about that. I wonder why mom threw you in the wash. Maybe, 
Maybe you got some filth on you. I'm sorry about that. It's it's a problem. It's my problem. And I apologize for, for doing that to you. But anyways, we need to get you to the sister's room. And I don't I don't know exactly how we're gonna do that. Do you have any ideas? You're you're worthless. You're absolutely no, 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 it's fine. You don't offer any kind of advice. You just need to be saved. Baby needs to save the monkey. And you're not gonna offer any kind of advice to help yourself out. Fine. You know what? Fine. You do you, and I will do me. I will be my baby. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm taking out all this aggression on you. I'm just scared. Really, what it boils down to is that I'm scared, okay? All right, let's do this. Let's do this, little monkey man. Okay, I'm gonna throw you over there, and and you just let me know if there's anything, you know, more dangerous over there. Any kind of lava monsters or anything like that? Okay, I'm gonna put you over there, all right? What the <laughs> That was not very good. All right, all right, fine. We need, we need blocks. We definitely need to put more blocks over there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get ahead over to this section, and we're just gonna toss some of these blocks over there. We're gonna get them near our sister's room so that we can make the very treacherous journey with our monkey friend to the bathroom, not the bathroom, to her bunk bed. What am I talking about? All right, we, we've got enough blocks over there, I think, I hope. Let's just try to use what we've got here to get across the very dangerous uh, lake of the living room. It's the lava lake of the living room. That's what, that's what we've coined it. Okay, we need this and we're gonna put this right here and then just use that to get across there. Perfect, all right. Monkey boy, get in there, get in there. Get to the volcano, stop, plug the volcano up. That's what started this whole situation. That volcano right there. It erupted and nobody stopped it and it filled the house with lava. Can you believe it? It's insane. Absolute madness. Get over there. No, you're very, very unwieldy. You're very difficult. Stop being so difficult. Yes, take care of the volcano over there. Okay, how are we gonna do this? I don't know if I can reach. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try here. This block is like right in my face. All right, I'm gonna try to reach for this one right there. Okay, okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. This baby's got some serious reach. Very impressive. Okay. Get that, no, don't knock your safety away. We need, oh, 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 remember the three second rule. We're okay, we're okay here. I just, I just wanna grab that and I just wanna get over there, okay. All right, now we're talking. Get to the monkey, save the monkey, save the world. Well, this is a tricky situation. Can we use our sister's shoes? Ooh, we can. All right, very good, very good. All right, let's get on the lava island. Here we go, I know it doesn't make sense that this is safe, but this is where all the lava came from. You stupid volcano, you ruined my day, had to make me save my monkey from the drying machine and get to the bunk bed without touching the floor? This is a very difficult day in a baby life and it's all your fault. Okay, we are so close. We are very, very close to our end goal. The problem is, is that we need to get the monkey up there. And I don't, he's very hard to throw. <laughs> He's <laughs> very, very difficult to throw. I would love to just toss him up there, but he doesn't, he doesn't always, oh no. Oh, I didn't want him to go over there. Now we have to save him from over there. All right, well, let's use what we've got here. Uh, we have like a Nerf kind of bullet type rocket thing that we can use. All right, we'll use that and then get across there. We'll use a paper airplane. Everybody knows paper airplanes are very effective against lava. Not really. Um, I find myself in a very kind of awkward situation now because I don't have any objects to really use. Maybe we can go up here. Ooh, yes, I like this. I like this. We'll use the, the what? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, the UFO didn't do that before. That is amazing. Uh, are, are you gonna come back, UFO? Are you coming back? You, you're gonna land? Or are you just gonna fly around? It's just gonna fly around. That is, that is awesome. That is really, really cool. I wonder if there's anything that you can do with that. Let me know if you guys know what we should do with the flying UFO here. Um, I have no idea. Maybe you fly the spaceman into it? I don't know. Anyways, we need to figure out how to get our monkey friend uh, back up here 
I'm just gonna kind of try to peek over the edge See if he's down there. I think he is. I'm, I'm very close to something though. I'm, I'm kind of nervous. There he is. Hey, buddy Can I can I use the force to pull you up here? It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. Oh, no. What are we gonna do? We've got to save the monkey That's the point of this whole thing all right, I think what we need to do is find some more objects to get ourselves over to our monkey friend. So let's just, let's just grab this stuff. All right, we're gonna grab this over here. I wanna go up on the chair and maybe use some of the objects that are up here. Oh yeah, here we go. We've got the VR Superman and we've got my little pony. There we go. That's actually a unicorn, not a pony, but that's fine. And we got cool glasses, so that's really gonna help us out, I promise. Okay, back down to safety. We're on our block of safety, so let's grab that over there. And then actually what I'm gonna do is toss that over there. And get the Superman VR. Okay, alright, this is working. And then get that. Okay, there. That should get us to the monkey. Then we just need to figure out how to get monkey Upstairs up onto the bunk bed of refuge. Okay. Come here monkey. Come here. Come here. Don't don't fight it. Okay. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's put him over there Maybe we can just maybe we can just climb the bunk bed with him in our hands. We should try that We should really try that. All right. Let's try Hey <laughs> I uh, I didn't realize that you could do that I thought that we would have had to uh, actually throw him up there, but all we had to do was hold him when we press the red arrow and it takes him up here with us. Now we can escape. This is our lava boat, basically. This is our lava boat. It's going to take us to safety and then we'll never have to see this terrible place again. You feel pretty good about that, monkey? Yeah, I feel real good about that. Cool. Awesome. Thanks for thanks for finally saying something and offering some dialogue here because you know, I'm kind of losing my mind. I'm a baby, I'm talking to myself, and, and you're my only friend. So, so please, be my friend, okay? What if we basically steal as much stuff from the house as we can and put it in our little baby pen here? I think that'll be a lot of fun. I think it's gonna be a lot of work as as well because uh, I, it's, I yeah, it's 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 hard to move around as a baby in this game. If if you could imagine, if you haven't played it before, it gets very tiring, and it's also very tiring to throw stuff. <laughs> you know, these controllers are not light. They're actually they got some weight to them. So getting all this stuff into our baby pen is gonna be a lot of actual work. That's right, we're like physical activity here. So I could use it, I could use it. Use, you know, get a little exercise, eh, all that stuff. Burn some calories, it's gonna be great. So I'm starting out with our little blocks here. We're just gonna throw all of these blocks inside of our pen and then we gotta move. I, I think what we're gonna do is just kind of take it room by room or at least do our best because uh, there's a lot of stuff in this game. I mean, there's there's a lot of items. Um, not all of them you can pick up and take with you, obviously, so we're not gonna take everything, but we're gonna try our best to get as much stuff as we possibly can. At least as much stuff as my body allows me to get because honestly, I might get a little tired. So let's get all of these blocks into our pen. Let me get this finished up and then I'll get back with you guys. We got a special guest with us today that you normally don't see. I don't know if he's on the camera right now, but Harvey is in the room, you know, my dog. Uh, normally, I don't have him in the room when I'm recording because he tends to make noise. Today, he didn't want to leave, and uh, I worry for his, his safety because uh, I can't see where I am, and I can't see where he is. I might actually, uh, I might step on him, but he'll move. He'll move if, <laughs> if I get a little too close to him. He'll probably move. He might get a little nudge from my foot, but uh, I don't know if you guys can see him on the camera. I don't think so. I don't think you can see him right now. But uh, he's he's pretty close to me. He's probably right in front of me. I don't know. I, again, you, you kind of lose perception of where exactly you are in the room when you're in VR. So I have no idea where he is. But hopefully we don't step on him today. But maybe you guys will get a little glimpse of him on the floor. We can't take this big fella. We can only bop him around. We can't take him with us. But we can take... Uh, I guess we can take the mittens with us. I, I have to actually crawl them back. I can't throw them. So... I'm just gonna manually take them back to the pen and then just drop them off there. There we go. Let's grab this stuff over here. Uh, can we actually put, oh, we can put the hat on. That's cool. 
Uh, the umbrella is a pain to throw around. It is so difficult to throw around, so I'm just gonna crawl it over to the baby pen here and just drop it like that. It, just get in there, you stupid umbrella. You can't throw it, it's too big. Ah, uh, there's more blocks over there, so we better go get them. Alright, looks like Harvey's leaving. So now I can actually close the door. Because, uh, normally I close the door when I'm recording. But I made an exception today because Harvey wanted to be in the room, but he just left. <laughs> he doesn't want to risk getting stepped on. So, uh, I'm gonna close the door here in just a second. Alright, door is closed. I still got this goofy hat on my head, and it's getting in the way of throwing stuff. So, let's drop it off in the, uh, in the baby pen here. Now, like I said, um, there might be some items that we miss here and there. I may not get every single item, um, but I'm gonna get as much as I can, and I'd love to fill this thing up just with junk. I think that would be a funny thing to just see. So we're gonna we're gonna do our best here. I'm already feeling the burn. I'm already kind of getting tired. But luckily, it's pretty cold in my house today. Um, it's it's normally not this cold here in California, but uh, it's been very cold lately. So it's pretty cool in my house. So uh, I don't have to worry about it being hot. I didn't turn on the heater purposely because I knew I was gonna be playing some VR. So. Now we can, uh, we can warm up with some exercise. So let's go ahead and start taking stuff from over here. And, and obviously the further away we get, the harder it gets to get stuff actually into our pen because we can't just throw it into the pen. We have to throw it kind of close to the pen and then, and then get it from there. So we're gonna do our best. Uh, let me grab this here. I still don't know, like, what? Do you think that means something? You think there's like a flower that we're supposed to put our little radish friend next to or something? I I really don't know. I don't know what that means, but uh, we'll just we'll just keep grabbing stuff and keep on throwing it over there. All right, I'm going to have to crawl the gun over to our pen because I can't actually throw it and I don't know how to drop it. So I'm just going to press all the buttons on the controller until it falls out of my hand. There it goes. Okay, there. We figured it out. I still don't know what button it was, but it worked. All right, so I'm just getting all the stuff that we threw from the TV into the pen. Um, we, can, we can grab all those books. I guess we do want to do that. So we'll probably head over to the bookshelf and knock all those books down and throw them into the baby pen. All right, bookshelf, you're my next victim. Get over here. Let's stand up. Yeah, makes things a lot easier. Just get all these books. I guess I'm, I'm right-handed, so it's kind of awkward to throw stuff with my left hand. Oh, it's terrible. These books are actually kind of hard to throw. They're kind of big, so I think I'm just gonna take them off of the bookshelf first, and then we'll kind of go from there. We definitely want this guy in our baby pen. Let's see if we can, no, almost, almost got him in there. Not quite, let's see if I can try, I'm gonna try to get a book from here. Huh. Nah, they're, they're too heavy. It's really hard to get them over there. All right, here's the last of the books. Now we just need to kind of figure out how to get them all back into our pen. I guess we can, we can throw this over there. There we go. That was a good throw. Um, the dominoes, I mean, they're they're dominoes. They're very tiny, so I don't think I want to throw every single one of them into our baby pen, but I'll take a couple of them. There we go. All right, let's get all these books into our baby pen. Oh, this is really, really difficult. I can't quite throw the books, so I just kind of have to, like, I feel like I'm herding, like, cows right now. Just, like, slowly guiding them the direction that I want to take them. Go, my herd of books. Go to your corral. That's where cows go, right? Maybe? I don't know. There, we got one in. We got one book of many. There we go. There we go. Yeah, just, a, just almost there. Yeah, let's stand up, actually. This will probably make it a lot easier. Can just kind of look over the top of the cage there and just... Throw them in like that. There we go. Now we got this. All right, so we managed to get all of the books into the baby pen. Look at that. What a mess. That is that is actually kind of awesome. I love it. Um, So where should we go next? I guess maybe let's make our way to our brother's room. We could go into the kitchen. But there's really not that much stuff in the kitchen that I want to put in the baby pen. Maybe like the microscope. Maybe the books that are up there. Maybe some of the fruit that's up there. I guess we could put the food from up on the, the uh, table into our into our baby pen. Yeah, let's do that. You know, in case in case we want to stay there for a while, we have something to eat while we're inside of our pen. That makes sense. Oh, but that's the problem is we eat it as soon as we pick it up. Yeah. So I, 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 I'll try to get it there, but, you know, I can't control myself sometimes. I just, 
I just gotta eat. I'm a hungry baby. I'm a growing baby. Let's grab this fruit. <laughs> you see, <laughs> I got a bite out of it as I threw it. Come on, stay away from my face. I did it again. I can't believe it. Here, grab that. Uh, I think that's a peach or something. Try to keep it away from my face. I'm doing my best, but I can't really, I can't really control it. Get some candy. Sure, why not? All right, let's grab the microscope. Let's get that. Yeah, this is cool. Can't eat that, so don't have to worry about, uh, Throwing it weird. I guess I'll try and get that book, but the cat might actually be protecting that now Just kind of looking around trying to see if there's anything else that I want to grab Um, I guess we could grab our, our monkey friend. Yeah, let's you know since we're over here We might as well grab our monkey friend and grab a piece of cheese. Sure. All right, so we'll knock over the broom Spring the trap open that up get little monkey man. Hey, come here. Come here. There we go. All right. We saved monkey man once again. All right. Let's get some of this. Oh, I just ate the cheese. All right. Well, I guess the cheese isn't going inside of the pen. Baby was hungry on the way from saving the monkey. So he wanted to get a little bite of that cheese. Let's get the banana in there. Remember, don't eat it. Just hold it kind of far away. And drop it in there. <laughs> there you go. I'm gonna try to grab the cake, but man, does that cake look good. That cake looks really, really good. All right, drop the cake in there. There we go, and get the microscope in there. Perfect, all right. I think we pretty much cleared up the kitchen as much as I'd like to. Uh, more than that, and I might have a heart attack from all the exercise I'm getting. All right, let's head to our brother's room, and let's see what kind of goodies we can get from his room and move into our playpen. All right, so of course we have Teddy over here, so we'll get, uh, we'll get Teddy a little bit closer Teddy, what are you doing? Why, go, Teddy, why aren't you throwing properly? Okay, Teddy is annoying. Let's get a soccer ball, sure. We'll get a soccer ball over to our baby pin right over there. Perfect, just stay over there, soccer ball. Don't go anywhere. Uh, we need Ultraman, of course. Uh, we'll watch him battle. Have they changed this at all? Have they made any changes to this stuff? Nah, it doesn't look like it. All right, same same story. All right, it's still cool. Uh, grab the water gun, and let's uh, crawl our way back to our baby pen. This thing is getting very, very full. Actually, a lot faster than I expected. I would like to... Okay, that's not exactly what I wanted to do, but I did want to drop it, so at least I did that. Uh, let's grab- How'd the soccer ball get back over here? Stupid soccer ball. Who would think that soccer balls bounce around? That's- this is very, very annoying. Get in there. No, don't bounce off. Get in- No! Hey! Come- so <sighs> Now you're gonna make me work for it. Alright, well that's incredibly rude. At least we still have Teddy. You're not going anywhere, right, Teddy? No, you're going right- into your new home. Enjoy it. Stupid soccer ball went as far as it possibly could have. Look at that. It's like the furthest corner that it could possibly go to. All right, well, whatever. Soccer ball will come back for you later. All right, uh, let's go back to our brother's room. Let's see what other stuff. I guess there's like all his car toys that we can, we can take. Oh yeah, you guys were telling me that we can steal this box, I guess, if we, if we do that? Is that, I don't think that works. How do I? How do I get the box, though? I don't... I don't know if that actually works. There must be a way to get the box. I don't know, I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Let's grab some of these toys over here. Like I said, the further away that we get from our baby pen, the harder it is to get items over to it. So, again, I'm, I'm doing my best, but keep in mind that I only have so much stamina. Like, I'm, I'm gonna get tired. I'm not gonna be able to keep doing this for too much longer, but I'm gonna try to get as much stuff in there as I possibly can, so let's keep it going. Uh, let's grab Dumbo up there. Let's get our little elephant friend and, um, yeah, sure, why not? We'll grab a clock. Um, where are you, elephant? There you are. Get over there. All right, fine. Um, I'll, I'll grab Ted here, our turtle friend, but he always follows us, so he's gonna leave. He's gonna leave the, uh, the baby pen. If we put him inside of it, can I take the pillow? No, can't take the pillow. Okay, all right, let's go. Let's get this stuff. Ooh, this is cool stuff. Yeah, get that semi-truck, please. Please, semi-truck. Um, grab Evil Knievel. I wish I had pockets. I wish I had baby pockets. You know, that would be kind of nice to be able to get around with my baby pockets, put stuff in my pockets, and then I could just take it all back with me. Uh, let's grab some of this stuff. Ooh, the tank, that's cool. Uh, can I? 
I just want to get it over there. All right, that worked out. Uh, the baseball bat's pretty cool. It might be a little bit difficult to get around. That worked out all right. Grab the the glove. I don't know if I'm... Oh, yeah, I was able to throw it. And uh, the robot. I like the robot. He's cool. Hey, Ted. How you doing, buddy? I'm just going back to the pen, all right? All right, so let's get all this stuff over to our baby pen. We got a lot of work to do. Okay, we've got a lot of junk here, and our robot's getting away. Come back, robot. Come back. All right, let's get back to our pen. I can only use one hand right now. It's very hard to crawl with only one hand, let me tell you. Babies must get really strong, because uh, I'm feeling like everything you do is a workout when you're a baby. My gosh. Okay, I think I've gotten everything from my brother's room that I wanted to grab. So we have all his little cars, we got some more of his little toys, we got his alarm clock, and of course we got his pet turtle. But he's just gonna, he's gonna follow us around, right Ted? Keep us company? Alright, awesome. So let's just drop all this stuff off, look at that. Oh my gosh, what a mess we've made. I love it. It's my new kingdom. It's all mine! This is my treasure pile. That's right. Baby has a new treasure pile, and it's all his. Hey, buddy. How you doing, Dad? Doing good? I'm just taking a little break, because I'm very, very tired. It's very exhausting to be a baby. I know, you probably know. Are you a baby turtle? Are you a baby turtle? You're a baby turtle. You know how it is. It gets... It's just tiring, and you're just always having to crawl around and collect stuff and play with weird toys. It's exhausting being a baby. And then you eat, and then you sleep, and then you poop. I mean, it's just... It's, there's just so much to do. There's not enough time in the day. Baby life is hard. I know. I know. You and me. We, we're in this together, though. I'll support you. You support me. We got this, Ted. We got this. All right, let's head into Sissy's room. Let's see what kind of stuff we can take. Man, she's got a lot of stuff, too. Um, probably her shoes. I'd love to get her shoes. They're very nice shoes. Oh, she's got the pink bunny slippers as well. Ooh, we need Astronaut Man. But Astronaut Man is really easy because you can just kind of guide him along. You just kind of float him to his destination. He's actually going to run into the wall here, but that's fine. You go. You go, Astronaut Man. Become the, the NASA pioneer that you've always wanted to be. All right, you're going to crash into that wall? That's fine. That's fine. Just they're perfect. Beautiful landing. Just beautiful. Well, the nice thing is that some of these things we can just put on our head. So we can transport them that way. That's real nice. All right, let's grab some of this stuff and then we'll we'll head back to our room. The, the, all right, let's just get this stuff over to our pen. Uh, we got the etch sketch. We got one pink bunny slipper. And of course we have our astronaut helmet. So let's drop that there, drop that there. And put that right there, looking good. All right, I'm gonna try to throw some of this stuff a little bit closer to our pen. Get the baking soda over there. Uh, grab the pink slipper, sure, why not? Do I really want trash? No, not really. I have enough of that already in my diaper. Uh, let's go ahead and put that on. And, uh, ooh, unicorn, we need the unicorn. No, I'm not gonna, can I grab the br brush? I can grab the brush, here you go. Yeah, you like that. You like that little, little piranha plant, don't you? Mmm, that feels good. Get your hair brushed. All right, perfect. Get the hair brush, and, uh, oh, let's put the glasses on, and then we'll grab this stuff and, uh, head down. All right, let's transport all of this stuff. <laughs> I look so funny wearing glasses and a, uh, NASA baseball cap right now. Holding a unicorn in a pink shoe. Yeah, you know, it's just another day in baby life, all right? There we go. Drop it off. Take off the hat. Take off the glasses. Oh, boy. We're almost there. All right, let's head back. Um, I'm not sure what else we want to grab. Uh, there might be some other little knickknacks here and there. Can we take the drum? Can we actually? No, nope, we can't take the drum. We can take these magazines, but they're kind of a pain because you can't. Look, I can't move when I'm holding them. <laughs> It's it's kind of hard to get around when you can't uh, you can't actually crawl anymore. Ooh, let's grab her piggy bank. Can we take the drums? Can't take the drums. We can play the guitar. We can play the guitar. See, I'm a musician. All right, enough of that. Uh, grab this stuff. Yeah, let's get this stuff. Can we crawl? We can. We can crawl with the magnifying glass. So let's take this stuff. I don't want to drop the piggy bank because it'll break if we drop it. So I'm just going to set it down nice and gentle in our baby pen. Just investigating my treasure pile here a little bit more closely using the magnifying glass. 
It's looking pretty good. I gotta say, I'm very, very pleased with the results of what we've done here. There's our magic uh, treasure chest right there. You can get a close-up look of it. Very nice. All right, put the magnifying glass down, and then very gently, we're gonna very gently put our piggy bank right there. You're gonna, you're gonna love it here. Yeah, yeah. Nice and gentle, though. Don't be too rough with the piggy bank. You might break it. All right, let's grab this stuff. Just get this stuff in there. And uh, I think I got pretty much everything that I want from my sister's room. Um, there might be a few little knickknacks here and there that we could have grabbed. But uh, I want to see what mom and dad got. And then I think that we're done with our challenge and we can just kind of gaze upon the glory of our of our treasure pile here. It's it's glorious. Let's get the dumb soccer ball. Try to grab it out of this corner. All right. I'm going to try to get it perfectly into the pen. Look at that. Look at that. What a throw. All right, don't stop moving though. It's it's gonna get away. All right, well, at least it's closer now. Uh, let's put on our 3D glasses so that everything is 3D now, you know? That's that's how the world works. As soon as you put on 3D glasses, everything becomes 3D. Uh, let's grab, hmm, what do we wanna grab? Uh, we have the cow head. Uh, I guess we can grab one of these dice. Sure, why not? All right, let's take, oh my gosh, you dumb soccer ball. Stop rolling. Let's see if we can hit it. Just kind of, I want to just knock it into the pen. Come on, go. Go, soccer ball. Go. No, you're going the wrong way. Go over there. There we go. Perfect. All right. Get this stuff in there. Take the glasses off. Put those in there. And we're going to just kind of, I want to get the soccer ball a little bit further in there so it doesn't roll around. All right, good. Oh, you know what we definitely need in our baby pen is car keys. And the car keys, I think, are up here. If I'm not mistaken. Yes, there they are. Is there anything up here that we can grab? I guess there's a triangle. We can grab that. Sure, why not? All right, let's put this stuff in our pen. We got the car keys. Very important. I, I wonder what else you can do with the car keys. They seem like a pretty interesting item. I wonder if there's some kind of secret associated with them. Let me know if you guys have any ideas for things that we can do with the car keys later on. All right, we made it to mom and dad's room. Uh, I guess you can, this is something that I didn't do. You can put the ring on your, on your finger? How do you, oh, it, <laughs> it goes over two fingers. That's funny. Uh, oh, it's so pretty though. It's very nice. Look at that diamond, holy moly. Dad didn't hold back when he bought mom this ring. That's a nice ring. All right, let's grab some stuff out of mom and dad's bathroom. I do want some some suds. I would love to have some soap in the bath, or in our, in our uh, playpen. And then let's grab a toilet plunger. I want the toilet plunger, come here. Oh yeah, you're coming with me. I can't move, okay, I can move. I figure. You know, you can use the plunger. You know, if, if you have two plungers, you can climb walls with them. No, that's not true. You can be like Spider-Man, you know, just tukuk, tukuk, tukuk. <laughs> It doesn't work like that. I'm sorry. I wish it did. I'm going to put this soap here. And now that I said that about the toilet plunger, I want to try it. I at least want to try to be baby Spider-Man because there is actually two plungers, right? There's this one over here. So let's grab the other plunger and see if we can climb walls with it. That would be incredible. All right, we got our spidey hands going. Let's see, <laughs> this is ridiculous. Let's see, no, it doesn't work. Oh man, come on. Come on, baby, climb the wall. Nope, doesn't work. Sorry, but it was worth a shot. All right, let's drop off the plungers. We got double plunger action going. That's awesome. I think that we're pretty much done. There was some stuff inside of the bathroom that I'd like to grab. We have Scuba Steve over here. Yeah, let's grab Scuba Steve and let's grab our boat. All right, there you have it. That's pretty sweet. Uh, I think the astronaut man, uh, I forgot to grab him. Here, let's get him into our pen. He can, oh, no, 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 no. You gotta fly. You gotta fly into it. You gotta make a grand entrance. So I'm just gonna fly him into the middle. Dun, 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 dun. There he goes. All right, he's done it. Beautiful landing. Well, Ted, what do you think? Pretty sweet, right? This is our new home. This is all of ours. We've stolen stuff from, from every room in our house and brought it back to our baby pen. And now we basically have everything we could ever want. Pretty sweet, right, Ted? Yes, that is very sweet. Thank you, Ted. I appreciate 
you reaffirming my idea here. I thought it was a pretty good idea. I think it turned out pretty good. What do you guys think? That's gonna do it for this episode of Baby Hands. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And of course, if you'd like to see more, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window. You can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.